What up, girl? How you doing, dude? Hell yeah, dude. Having a good weekend, it sounds like. Fucking finally warm here, man. Feeling good. Doing good myself. Beautiful weather out this morning. To hang out with Doggo a little bit. What's up, Santu? Fucking feels good to have killed Mithandra yesterday. That was hard. <laughs> now we can actually move on to some bigger and better things. Right. <laughs> the monk is so awesome. I'm considering respecting the tavern brawler for our accuracy, man. Because, I mean, the build is sick, but missing is fucking bullshit. And I'm not sure how we improve our accuracy, right? Is it just dex? Is that how you improve accuracy? We need dex boosting gear if that's the case. We need something, man. These 50%, 55%, 60%, this is not it's not cutting it, man. And I mean we really respect that wisdom save specifically for Mithander. What's up, Mesh dude? How you doing, bud? Yeah, 50 and 60% hit rating is fucking brutal, dude. I think all of our attacks against Smith Thunder are only 55s, man. A lot of charms and stuff later on. Yeah, I mean, what are we getting right now? Wisdom saves. And I, I think wisdom's a little bit of damage. A little bit of armor. But... Does Tavern Brawler give me better armor? Or not? Yeah, exactly, Mash. Exactly. That's the problem. If I would have had more uh, hit rating, I could have actually punched him with Thander a little bit. But I don't want to get in melee range and whiff, you know? The build is fine. She is, she is hard to hit, but all the bosses are going to be hard to hit. I think I think it's I think we were the same level, right? Mithander was probably level four, maybe level five. What up, do man? I hope you're doing well, bud. We're just talking about whether we want to go tavern brawler spec instead of uh, wisdom. Thinking about it. I mean, the wisdom saves probably help for Auntie Ethel, right? Because she is old person also. Probably helps us for a lot of bosses. Alright, we'll, we'll stick with the wise monk, I guess, for a little bit here. What's up, guys? Cheers, everybody. Also, we use like every damaging scroll that we had during that fight too. So we have to replenish our wares. Those scrolls, those fireball scrolls, carried that fight so hard, man. So we're gonna we're gonna need to find some more, buy some more, maybe some pickpocketing. I don't know. I think we're like out of NPCs now, traders, basically. There it is. I I don't I don't even know what we do now in the grove now that everyone's dead. Yeah, we need to do a little scavenging here in the grove, especially. Sorry, Lewin, yeah, I'm I'm going. <laughs> I'm starting. Uh we should do a long rest probably, huh? 
Yeah. Before we get ambushed somehow or something. Probably a good play. Normally there would be a celebration. Oh wait, are we celebrating? Oh shit. <laughs> What's up, Shame Socks, dude? <laughs> are we celebrating? <laughs> Not this one. No, this. It says he's a vendor, but he doesn't look like a vendor. So, is there anything we can do in the party that helps us? Reynard, I hope you've been well. Welcome in. Uh, There's a couple people alive. Some people that hid, it looks like. Night. When you heal a creature. That's... That would probably work for myself, right? We're gonna have to try it. <gasps> no gold! Oh, man. Brutal. Zero gold. Mm, we can sell that. Alright, now we got gold. Hell yeah, happy birthday, Reynard. I hope you enjoy this Steam Deck. Uh, Chromatic Orb, False Life. Slow could be useful. Can I pickpocket him or something like something that? Iconic, but not too much of a mouthful. We don't want to exclude the common. A wonderful one indeed. Now okay, I don't know what's happening there. Ah, fuck this party. Huh? Got the fully extended uh, edition trilogy of Lord of the Rings? Hell yeah, man, I love Lord of the Rings. It's such a comfy thing to watch. Buzz Gotta rewatch that like quiet. once every couple of years. You've picked up a few pleasant memories on your you sleep alone. Go to bed alone, that was my only option. Feels bad. <sighs> Just like you real know. life. I am house. What the fuck are you? Seen to the leaders of that goblin. Don't what I sent. Oak father, but uh, how is this possible? I would. There's a chokehold of magic. Bind a drink. All right, no indeed. idea. Any pay that place is where the compress it's in at last. A cure is in reach. Moonrise Sour. An ancient what fuck is Akira? Abandoned for years and for wait for y few survive long. Those Akira, Akira. You, you could go. If you take my from, if you can find this place, oh my god, shut the fuck already. up, Halden. If only I the decision you made, oh. I long sought to return to my oh. unfinished. I had May Sylvanus. Jesus Christ, fucking lingerer, man. <laughs> can we pickpocket his ass? It looks like he has some good stuff. <laughs> the motherfucker look rich. <laughs> Dude is yapping, right? <laughs> I didn't know he'd show up either. Oh, uh, we'll pick our eyeball out too eventually. I don't think we need it right now though. We'll wait a little bit. Man, I kind of want to go. If we die this wrong, I kind of want to go Ogre Mancy. That's what I was thinking. Apparently, you can resummon these guys. True? That's a thing? Somebody got. 17 int hat. I guess we'll start. I wish we could use like a town armor and then you could like hard swap between it. That's not a thing you can do, is it? When healing another, the character gains points. Oh, yeah, I want to check if that ring works. Wait, did we buy the ring? I don't think we bought the ring. Sure didn't. Oh my god, who are you? The tieflings have moved on. Oh no, more more tieflings. There's barely any in checks. There's a lot of dialogue in checks that will help, so that's why we'll have it as our communal uses. Our travelers. Really? I can't loot this corpse? Are you fucking kidding me? I mean I can just kill her, right? Right? 
Yeah, I'm thinking about doing an ogre mancy, like a healer class, and just summon the ogres every fight. Is that something I can do? I can just summon ogres over and over again. Don't risk being in open view. Yo, this bitch, man. You really telling me I can't loot this dead body after I just saved everybody? Are you fucking serious right now? Are you fucking serious? Out of sight, out of mind. Yeah, but she's gotta go. You have to pass the persuasion check every time you battle. That sounds fine, right? That sounds fine. Free for the day. Violence isn't tolerated in these parts. Wait, the bear, the tusk is gonna attack me? I didn't sign up for that. No one had to get hurt. All I was doing was trying to loot corpses. Why would you do that? Why? No more blood had to be shed here. Fuck. Gooberry? Worth, man, worth. Yeah, alternately you can pay them, right? Maybe the pig was gonna eat the bodies. Uh, maybe she was being fucking selfish for her pig. That could have been what it is. Like, no, you can't leave the bodies. Tusk is going to eat them. What a bitch, dude. Yeah, she gave 20 XP worth. Speaking of, don't we get some, like, insane thousand XP thing? For, like, saving the grove? <laughs> Where's my reward, huh? I feel like this should be a reward. Oh, I'm gaming. I'm gaming. Ha <laughs> ha, over and come these nuts. I mean, I don't mind paying them. I, I mean, if I can do it, we could do like high charisma. Build and Ogremancy sounds fun. Hmm. Sounds cool. Here? Can a bard heal? Oh wait, they don't count as in my party, so I don't know if I can do bardic shit to them. Maybe I can. It depends if there's healing bard. Yeah, Ogremancy sounds fun as fuck. I feel like, oh, there's people alive still. Oopsies. Well, how are you? It's oh, it's this one. Halsin's canceled the right. The brood is exposed. Yo, someone should give me like a thousand XP, right? Wow, she has 84 hit points. I don't think we can kill her. Oh my god, the little merchant's alive, actually? By the tree, but you've solved both those problems in one, of course. So now is the grove like here to stay? Like it's not gonna just disappear? We have access to the grove like permanently? Until we go to the other axe. Kilcog, she has the amulet. What kind of amulet? Can we handle the mess? I don't know. Do I look like a brain reader? You can come back, so okay, so we don't really want to murder anyone else here. Actually. Because this, this is like one of our last vendors. Uh, you got no scrolls, so they're there. What poopy scrolls do you have? May you keep luck. Don't want to draw any attention. Man, there's like no one here. Give me the loot. Aw, oh, no loot? Are you kidding me right now? Wow. That's ridiculous. It 
It's like someone already went through all the shit before the before I got here. It's like there was another thief. Yeah, Blacksmith is no longer with us. He might have died in the fight. I actually don't remember. What's his name? Diamond? Bet that will fit in my pack. I bet that will fit in my ass. Oh, someone's alive. Breathe quiet. A group of someone's. Man, they really did take all this stuff with them, eh? Kind of crazy. Softer than a whisper. They're not gonna see, right? Better be something in here, though. The Dork Urge, that's a hell of a name. Oh. Wow, a one to start the stream off. Is that an omen? <laughs> First of all, the day is the fucking snake eye. Boy, I really expected some better rewards for this, guys. Thank you, Houdini. Was like, maybe I didn't do the quest right or something? Makes your attacks do an additional poison damage every time you heal. Oh my god, that sounds so good, but Kaga sounds so sketch. Anything of use? She has 84 health. 84. It's quite, quite terrifying. She's tough, but she won't be that bad because she's isolated there. Are you trying to throw the run? Kind of sounds like you're trying to throw the run, but I really like poison amulet. Oh my goodness. What is happening? Hey. Are the little babies even here? Man, we got a long way to go, Fungi. What's up, Loop? I was really hoping the Grove quest would give us like a thousand XP, but it really didn't. <laughs> are the demon baby? Okay, the demon babies are still here. What's up, Yuffie? Where did they find all this car? Man, why does Kaga have so much health, though? It's scary. You're starting to feel like my. Per why you have? Why is this guy all fucked up? Man, the, even the demon babies don't have a vendor here. What the fuck? That guy's all messed up. Can you kill the birds? I'm thinking about it. Yeah, I don't think we get a reward for it anymore though, cause all the demons are gone. That might be worth a look. The hell is this? Oh, it's an alternate entrance. Maybe some of these druids will help me bully Kaga or something. The druids are still chilling. Oh, their idol's not here anymore. Weird. I'm not singing your. It wasn't up. Sound like she wanted to start some shit there. Oh, well, there's nothing over here. Fuck's sake. Thanks, Yuffie. It was fun. 
They're mad at me for killing the goblin army? What kind of bullshit is this? Oh, there it is. You've done it. No, I oh. cannot imagine taking on a camp full of goblins was a simple task. To be expected. Let me show you on your map where you can find the cache. Oh. Take this rune. Place it among the pedestals inside our library. When the wolf glows brightest, everything in the vault below. Oh, will be yours. is he actually giving me a reward? Is that in here? He's telling me I can loot in here? Is that what he's saying? Pink. What else do we need? It's in here? So, okay, I'll just, I'll, I'll read like a real gamer. I tried. Okay, where are we going? <laughs> I ch oh wait, is it already just open? Oh shit! What the fuck is happening? A parasite. Take it. It might be useful. Puzzle. Something about make the moon shine. Might be useful. Oh, we can get Haslin's pipe to him. I'm sure he'll appreciate that. I gotta put something on here. Put tablet in slot. Alright, if I was a tablet, what the fuck would I look like? Rune of the Wolf. Oh, puzzled. Ten whole XP. We're rich. Super rich. Man, you got me really trying to kill Kaga right now. What does she do? She turns into a bear? We are Wisdom Monk. That's what we are doing, Yuki. What's it called? What's our class called? Uh, our subclass? She does seem pretty strong. That's why I'm scared. Sorrow. Wow, it's kind of it's kind of butthole, huh? It's just a weapon that makes me sad. Oh yeah, we're like Curse of Elements, monk. Is that why it's called Sorrow? Because it's miserable. Okay, well, we got we got potions and we got fly. Okay, that's that's the real, the real loot. Resistance to cold damage, interesting. All right, not so bad. I know, I want that ring, dude. I really do want Kaga's ring. Poison damage sounds awesome. What does this lead, huh? Death? Oh, wait, we've been here. I think. Oh, cool. You can get through the dro grove like that. What's up, Chris? I didn't know that. <laughs> Man, oh, boy. <laughs> the mayonnaise menagerie. Uh, let's go to the Underdark and see if we can't find some more stuff to buy. 
She gives a ring that makes me do poison damage on hit after I heal, it sounds like. Which, which could be pretty good. It sounds very good. But she has 84 health, man. And I think she can transform into like a Liger or something crazy. That sounds sketchy. Well, right now. Waiting for that idiot Balin's return. Unless you've seen him, we don't have much to discuss. I need good scrolls. Weapon attack still two damage. Fuck. Lame. Ah, bunch of bullshit. I mean, we don't need sorrow. We do want the arcane blessing. We can sell the sparks well, the watcher's guide. We're gonna sell this. All right, we're getting our money right. Helmet is smiting. Breastplate. We might want to keep that cold resistant armor. That could be good. When you heal another creature, that's not gonna work. What's up, Spots? My inventory is messy? Did I get boots of speed? Um... If you're talking about these, yes. Well, I think these are the best boots because we're monk, right? So we can do that infinite jumping shenanigans so these boots that help us jump are probably better than the boots of speed that's that's my logic what's up fry because you know we're like uh frog monk we're jumping no longer takes an action type shit you know what i'm saying makes sense to you i'd show you but i don't want to waste a key point my inventory's fine what are you talking about it's totally fine Probably just some alchemy, though. Yeah, frog shoes, yeah. I would like to get... You can trade them for passage across to Germforge without combat. I don't really understand what you're saying. You can trade them for passage... So I don't have to do the boat thing? The boat fight? Could sustain an entire village if seen it properly. Fuck, how much strength do we need to throw Dro? I forgot about the boat fight's kinda coming up. Welcome back. Have you made any new discoveries? I mean, optimally we just do fights and win, right? In a perfect world. Maybe we want to respect Tavern Brawler for that fight. Does anyone know how much strength I need to throw those little... Are they not dwarves, right? They're... Are they dwarves or are they drill? Fuck if I know. Let's go kill some herpes. I think we'll be strong enough. The fight on that boat is hella fun. Well, shit, though. We don't really want to throw everyone's body into the water. But, I mean, it's either skip the fight and miss loot or throw bodies in the water. Miss loot to get XP, right? Man. Maybe we'll kill everyone on level five.
It seems pretty sketchy. Unless that boat quest is worth the same XP as taking the boat and killing the guys, then maybe. Good thing to consider, Houdini. All right, we're about to do some herpes shit. <laughs> Man, that is so good. If we wanted to do Ogre Mancy, we need this helmet. You know, Dini, that actually sounds like the safe play. We should probably do that. The boat fight seems like it could be a shit show. Especially if we don't know how much strength to throw, dudes. Start of combat, I gain momentum. Yeah, boat fight, and I can get thrown off the boat also, right? Wait a second. You can't be knocked prone or moved against your will? Well, that sounds perfect for the boat fight. <laughs> does that work against the herpes too? Oh, well, it is medium armor. But does that actually hurt us? Oh my god, it takes my armor class down like four. Okay, we don't we don't really want that. <laughs> Damn, 20 armor, 20 armor class hype. That's sick. Sick gnome at the top of the Mycodon colony gives you boots for curing her. So, are we just gonna rely on... Fuck, I want that Calm Emotion spell or something for these herpes guys. Uh, I'm fucking scared. Does anyone know where we can... How we can, like, survive the herpes song better? More consistently? We got no silence scroll. Lightning charge gloves? No, but we have armor class plus two gloves. I'd rather have those than a deathless. Bonjour, Dreamy. I feel like we should definitely have some sort of defensive thing here. Before we do the herpes fight. Well, we do have proficiency in wisdom saves. We do, but that it's not going to be enough, I think. Alright, if we want to do this the safe way. Happy Easter. Maybe the goblins aren't pissed at us. Uh, should we go see? Oh shit, we got this. Okay, we probably want luck of the Far Realms. I can't remember if that's good or not. Oh, can I make some sort of potion, Fupa? Is that what you're saying? That also sounds fairly good. Yeah, I remember charm being underwhelming. I guess we'll move towards this, right? 10 temporary hit points until long rest. 
And it possibly stuns nearby enemies. I'm scared of the harpies without some sort of fucking concentration spell. What are you saying Valo could help us with, Fupa? Like how would Valo help us here? We'll go see if the goblins are pissed. My guess is yes. <laughs> is this a meme? Okay. Games like this in my youth. Was I sweet once? So yeah, what happens in the goblin camp after you've defeated them at the grove, guys? They are pissed. The goblins will be out for blood after what happened at the oh, grove. There it is. Best to stay clear. We'll be ready for a fight. Yeah. Hmm. They're only level two. Let's use the hill strength so we can throw some goblins, eh? I feel like this is gonna be easier than harpies, right? Oh, what? How did that happen? That's not what I was going for. Maybe I should. No, this is good. What? That is not good. What are you doing? That didn't do as much damage as I was hoping at all. Uh oh. Rut row. That is not a summon dog. Oh shit, I should have killed the drum, huh? Well, the dogs are scary. These guys are a little bit stronger than I thought. Twenty three health, huh? Eighty percent chance to hit. I disagree. Oh my god, we did so much damage, holy shit. <laughs> That's insane. Cause even though we miss the fangs of the snake, it gives me fire damage on my unarmed attacks. Cover me! I'm going for the alarm! That's gonna be fine, right? Maybe? I don't see anyone coming. Right. You can call it Ghostbusters. One health, real? I was invisible. 
And they didn't find me. That's why combat ended. From killing that other goblin. Which is not bad. Because it's consistent. I'm like stealth. What's up, Choi? I know, Dark Urge is so awesome. <laughs> but actually, next time we're going to go Outlander background. So we can try to get extra XP from discovering the delusion of the swamp. And for early Owlbear XP, I think, is what we're going to try to do. Mm. I mean, I don't think we need to go invisible this turn, right? Should I kill this warg, huh? It was not incredible damage. I don't want to get shot by a bunch of people, but we should have advantage. That one's not a summon, the one that I attacked? No. That one, I believe, is. I don't want him to die and then me go invisible and then combat end. He's like our get out of jail free card, this guy. Is there any value getting the deluxe version of Baldur's Gate 3 on Steam? Pretty sure you get like dice or something stupid. <laughs> I don't think so. I'm not 100% though. Big roll. Nice. Get a digital art book. Fuck that. Unless you're like super fan. You get a real life helmet? Okay, that sounds kind of worse. This is a badass. Oh. Uh, why? Why can't? What do you mean? Not enough movement. What do you mean? Not enough movement. That's better. <laughs> Throwing shit <is> so good. <laughs> It's so fucking good. Uh. You get the soundtrack too. I don't. I don't know if it's that great. You get to meet the meet the real Shadow Heart. <laughs> a meet and greet and a one on one with Shadow Heart. Worth. Hmm. I guess we should kill Claw. Or not. Sneaky son of a bitch. Why do you mean I can't reach these people? What is happening here? I think we'll go for Claw. I think he's the biggest threat. Oh, this goblin's gonna hit me. Maybe we should hit the goblin. Yeah, this this cloak is stupid good. Holy fuck. Ah! 
man, look at XP farm. <laughs> More XP than the, actually, I wonder if the combat for the Grove was the XP that, you know, we get. I bet, I bet we got a lot of XP from all, all that fight. I'm pretty sure we just hit level four before the Grove fight. Combat was the XP. That makes sense, actually. There was a lot of enemies. Nice miss. Is this only short rest? Once per short rest? Or long rest? I can't tell. I don't remember what per rest it is. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> kind of feel bad for Claw. He's getting bullied hard. Poor guy. Can we be friends? You can go to my camp. I got a couple furry friends there. Catch arrows always up, you think? <sighs> no naked dwarf behind. Nanelion, my homie, welcome in, guys. The build is good, but... I don't know if we want to respect the tavern brawler now, because our I believe our accuracy improves if we become a tavern brawler, which is is good, I think. Time to get going. But right now we have like we're the wise monk with eighteen wisdom, so I mean that helps against casters. Cast is kind of scary, right? Oh, these guys must have been the drum people. Or are they all? Oh, God, they're so far away. Good luck getting over here. Wisdom is perception checks? No, I don't think we're skilled in perception. Because we, we can't perceive anything. I, I, is it an int check? Is it not? Or charisma? Because I feel like we miss per perception checks constantly. So yeah, if it's called Word Companion, that means that it is uh, summoned. With Tavern Brawler, you have a 95% chance to hit basically everything. I know, that sounds good. It sounds really good. Not with bows, though, right? Just melee? Oh, this guy's name was Turd for a second. Hmm... Damn, this guy's smart. He summoned that dog so far away. Just a melee and throwing. Still sounds kind of nice. If we did want to respect Tavern Brawler, we'd want to do it, like, now. Because we could throw... Goblins like crazy for bonus damage, right? Did this guy heal himself again? Did I see that correctly? I 
I don't want to get shoved off this. Oh, wait, did that not do damage to me? You'd be in melee range of others if you don't kill enemies? No, because we have ranged monk moves that benefit that are technically unarmed, right? All of our monk stuff gets boosted. Even the uh, the ranged ones. How would I lose AC? Excuse me. How would I lose armor if I went uh, Tavern Brawler? Because I'd have one less wisdom point. Open hand monk is better. I wonder if that was a wisdom save. Target outside normal range. There we go. Well, I thought that if we were going to go Tavern Brawler, we wouldn't really change our stats. We would just keep potions of the Hill Giant up at all times. I think we would just lose one point of wisdom. Because right now we want resiliency wisdom. Good morning, River. But I guess that kind of hard locks us into uh, Ogre's Strength Potions then. Yeah, it's not too. I would only lose one point of wisdom, though. I'm not even sure if that's a one-to-one -one ratio of wisdom to armor count, either. Yeah, we on our way here. You know what? I bet there's a fucking explosive barrel hanging around someplace near Kaga. Cause she has a good ass ring. I bet you there's some barrels left around. Man, we fucked those goblins up. Tavern Brawler gets you plus one to strength or constitution, so I wouldn't lose the stat point. We just have to move it around. Okay, so we would lose one point of wisdom, but then we'd gain one point of constitution, so we'd gain more hit points. Am I too short to get this fucking barrel? Yeah, I'm mainly thinking about respecting specifically for the goblin camp so I can eat goblins, right? And then we can respect back. I can't. I'm too short. <laughs> I just can't get that, apparently. I'll take that. Yeah, it's probably worthless, anyways. Oh, 
Oh yeah, he angry. No. Okay, that actually worked. We got lucky. Uh oh. Guy's getting all up in my face. And I apparently used my actions somehow. Fuck. Critical mess. That's not good. Okay. Man, he did a lot of fucking damage, guys. 75% chance is not very good. No one, we miss them constantly. Yo, we're gonna die because we didn't go time roller because I cannot hit anyone still. This is so fucking stupid. 70% chance is missing. 75. Oh, really, game? Really? I can't fight this one fucking guy? I'm, I'm, I'm literally just sewing key points away. You know? So rip and my entire like the the monk is completely worthless right now <laughs> because I can't land any any shots. Ah, right, we're gonna go respec. Yeah. I think a respec actually gives us a long rest. Which you can actually not exploit. This We're not gonna exploit, We're just gonna use it because this one. Right. Man, that was fucking bullshit. As the that was fucking bullshit. Alright, so what we're gonna wanna do here. This, and then we put... No, we won't have more key now, but we won't waste it all missing everything. You know what I mean? We miss every one of our attacks against that guy. <laughs> so, like, <laughs> we can't do monk shit if we can't hit in the first place. So we will be able to put a point in Constitution, then. And then... Where do we put these extra points in? Oops, what did I just do? Fuck. I did some automatic bullshit. <laughs> okay, we're good there. Charisma? Take the strength if we're going tavern brawler. Fuck, I wish I could take perception. Later we can respec again once we get some more hit rating somehow, okay?
Okay, there we go. So now we're gonna have to find elixir, uh, elixirs of hills, potion shit. No, we're just gonna have to use the elixirs constantly for a bit, shoe. We'll respec later, I think. But we're definitely gonna wanna go buy some of these. I guess we have one active right now. I guess that doesn't cut us a long rest. I thought it did. Always room for more. I'm a broke ass. The hag sells three helixes a day, but she's no longer in the grove. Can we make friends with her right now and just uh, keep buying them from her at the at the swamp in the swamp? That's a friendly looking shadow. Is that a thing we can do? We actually want this guy's ring real bad, too. Another step forward. I squandered my surprise. Ah, oh, that guy's gonna be a problem. Shit. Oh yeah, and this actually really synergizes with our monk jumping too. We need to find the recipe for Hill's Giant Strength Potion, it sounds like. Wow. Teamwork? Really? Nice. Yeah, the dude on top is a problem. Especially if he goes wakes up all these guys. Uh oh. Hope your soul is in good hands. Oh, it feels nice to actually hit our enemies. Ninety-five percent chance, twenty-six to forty-two damage. Are you fucking kidding me? That's so much. Yo, Devin brother, what the fuck is up? <laughs> Those are some very high damage values. Okay, maybe we won't respec again. This is kind of ridiculous. I, I don't know, because people, because Wizard Monk sounded cool. I, that's really the only reason. Actually using the staff to attack. 
Because my monk uh, things don't use the staff to attack. That makes sense. I'll strike you down. No ring hype. Swift as my feet can carry me. No, these are unarmed. My spells are unarmed attacks, I, b I believe. They're all called fist of something. All right, fist of unbroken air. Maybe? This thing gives us move speed. Hmm, kind of in a tough spot here, actually. I'm gonna have to kill this org. Wait, why am I, why is my? Okay, because that's not melee. I mean, 13 to 27 damage is pretty solid. Get fucked, dude. <laughs> oh my god. What's up, this one guy? Just out of you. Right into my surprise. Happy Zombie Jesus Day, Dangle. Yeah, now we got a new ring that gives us plus three movements. Not bad. Ah, shit, he's still there. Oh, I don't want him to wake those guys up. Yo, look how high we can jump with Tavern Brawler. This is insane. Whoa. Oops. Oh, the fucking tree is in my way. I'm struggling. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, why did they wake up? That's not good. That's not good. Uh oh. Breathe deep and move. You think they'll go back to sleep? <laughs> That's Tavern Brawler jumping, man, because jump is tied to strength. <laughs> they heard the thud of your massive Tavern Brawler cock hitting the ground. Oh, they're going back to sleep. Yo, that's sick. We're dangerously low on key right now. But I'm pretty sure we can assassinate this guy still. Ha! 
Oh yeah. <clears throat> sure can. I'm coming for you. Think I'm back to sleep here. I'm not buggers got it in for us. I don't think we're gonna be able to stuff their way out of this. What up, Brun? Why can't I reach this? No, I didn't mean to throw. Oh, no. I just wanted to move. These boots have seen everything. Okay, phew. Oh, sketchy. <laughs> I thought I wasted my jump for a second. Sheesh. I mean, maybe I can just archer here. Maybe we can just stealth out of combat. Work. I'm a sneaky boy. I mean, if we can kill one with the bow, then we get the invisibility and then we'll leave combat. I'm talented. I feel like I should be able to leave combat just like this, though, right? Like, they have no idea where the fuck I am. Going on there, buddy. Well, it looks like we're gonna have to use invisibility. Oh, that one went back to sleep. Okay. I think jumping will wake him up, though, right? Go back to sleep, bro. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> it's like, wake up! <laughs> that was sick. I'm kind of stuck up here, though. Someone needs to come over to me so I can fucking get my invisibility proc. But too far. Son of a bitch, this is frustrating. Um. Please just fuck off. <laughs> Go to bed. Or get closer. Uh, maybe we can hoot that guy. Nope, he went in the hole. Oh, this is frustrating. I guess I could use a slow fall potion and just bail, huh? 
Annoying asses. I can actually throw the boots on. Wait a second. Is this gonna work? I'm kinda scared of not understanding this. <laughs> Have to keep going. <laughs> so much for that. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that didn't work at all. Uh, <laughs> well, I had some built in slow fall shit, but it didn't seem to do anything. Quite the cozy setup you have here. <laughs> I said you can use your reaction to, like, not take fall damage. <laughs> Didn't seem to work. <laughs> uh, okay, whatever. We'll do a long rest. <laughs> Luckily, we can jump super far, so it doesn't really matter. We're going to need to get these hill potions, though. So we're gonna go visit the hag and hopefully uh, she don't attack me. Because I don't think I have the ability to create these potions yet. I do not. Someone said it's safe though. What is the... Oh, Riverside. Yes. Is it worth using the Titan bow? String bow? Probably. I don't... I've never got it before. She just... Uh, you have to, like, try to get in the fight, right? Oh. Wait, where is she? Oh, I see. I'm just here to do business, Hag. Hello, what do you say? Want me to take care of the little bugger? Nice. Oh, they're fucking expensive, man. Oh, she got those too? Ooh. Very expensive. Oh man, you know the other part about Tavern Brawler that's cool? With these strength potions, we can actually carry shit. Which I enjoy. Ah, good. Might be similar to buy the ingredients. Yeah, see, the problem is we don't know how to make the fucking potion, though. <laughs> I don't know how to get the recipe. I just get the ingredients and then start... Hopefully, I unlock the recipe. And stack the ingredients three times. So what are they? Fingers and what else? What else do we need? Oh, uh, we should actually be able to teleport to the goblin camp. How did he see me? Bloody work. Oh shit, I forgot to drink my potion. Ha! Fuck. <laughs> any suspension plus finger salts. When you say any suspension, what does that mean? Ha! 
it's just a type of map. Some break down assaults and some break down the suspensions. Okay, I think I got it. So we'll just keep our eyes open for fingers. I'm really hoping this vendor is not aggro in the goblin camp. Where's this warg coming from? Oh, wow, it didn't get dismissed. Oh, shit. Damn it, man. Fucking stupid warg. I can't climb this because I'm a gnome. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Gnome problems. Why? How did that jump wake them up? Oh my fucking god! This is frustrating. <laughs> Wait, did he just unsummon his? Oh, he summoned a new one. <laughs> Fuck's sake. How did that wake them up? I jumped so far away. Annoying ass. Watching me. Um, the, the strategic point of the gnome was that on our previous playthrough, we died to Minthara's whole person. And gnome cunning gives a wisdom check advantage. So that was to counter Minthara. This time, we used the ogres to soak so much of Minthara's uh, spell slots that. We actually didn't even see a hold person. One of the booyogs did actually hold person us. Oh, they hold person someone, not us. Yeah, that was that was our troubleshooting or our strategy to not get held personed. I don't help with harpies too, because harpies have a a charm as well. Yeah, whole person's whole person's always annoying as shit. It's serious run under, you know. It kind of seems like Gnome is just the best class for this. Seeing as in, at any point in time, someone can whole person you and one shot you. You know what I mean? Hard, hard to beat. Happy Easter, Max. Ah, uh, he cared him for one. That's silly. Yeah, I'm gnome cunning pretty strong. Mm. Yeah, where do we get that strength bow? Sounds like it would be really good for what we're doing here. Fucking warg. Oh yeah, I wanted to check my armor class. We did, we lost one single armor from the respec. So one wisdom equal one armor, it seems like. But we did also gained the health points, right? Oh. 
So disengage also allows us to jump. I'm going to disengage, jump over there, punch that guy. Ah, it seemed like the play. I mean, we don't have a punch available. But 75%. God, the fucking misses in this game. There's such a fucking meme, dude. Uh-oh. Ow! The crits. The crits. I think we kill him, though. Man, we rolled like absolutely bare minimal there. There it is. Ew! That was a shit roll <laughs> on that first hit. What up, China? What up, Wombat? And happy Easter, guys. I mean, we're gonna short rest here, anyways. The crits. Dang. It's gonna make me go prone. Fuck. Try me. Yeah, where do we get this Titan bow from, guys? Because we're not doing shit for damage. With our ranged attacks. Whoa. Ah, the burning hideout place. And the only safe way for us to get there is by killing the Knoll boss, right? So we can find the password. Unless someone knows of another safe way to do it. <sighs> Maybe it's because my proficiency is whack. Oh, we're using a short bow. That's a good question, Shu. I, I didn't even think about that. Hmm. I'll feel that one later. Some nasty fuckers got it in for us. We got ogre here. Hmm. You can get grip branded by the Lady Goblin? Yeah, we already fucked it up, Ham. We already fucked it up. I tried to engage. 
I tried to get the dialogue to pop up. And then I failed to do it. And then I ran away and now they're all in the cave in a defensive position. I think we're going to do Skull of Magic Mirror here. And take this goblin on one on one. I mean, this ogre. Crazy as that sounds. <laughs> Fuck. One day I'll catch a break. I was really hoping to not use these mirrors immediately. I don't think monks can use longbows. No, my mirrors, I need it for this guy. Well, that didn't do as much damage as I was thinking it was going to do. Maybe we should be a little careful with this guy, huh? He's a, he's a little scary. Just a little bit. Now, if we can shoot one of these guys, if we can kill one of these goblins, we can get advantage on our melee attacks. Does advantage just improve my hit chance or is it also damage rolls? Oh, I ain't get it. How is this only 30% chance? I guess that one is not melee. Two health, uh oh. Give me invisibility. What? Why did it? Oh, he's blocking it. Okay, the mirror was pretty nice. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> oh my gosh, just dying of two health. Thank you. Fucking scary ass motherfucker. <laughs> God, I wonder how much that slam would have hit me for. Who knows what that thing could crit? Could be a lot. Could have been stuck in a big. I don't know. Maybe we were in danger <laughs> of losing. Time for some bloody work. Not the vines. I always forget about the fucking vines. Every goddamn time. Fucking vine memes, man. You think if he crit, he would have killed me? His club is bigger than me, yeah, exactly. Weird, why is this healing me? That's a lot of healing, huh? I don't think that healed last time. Uh, 
Um, it's our cloak, Mr. Big Dog, from the Dark Urge. It's stupid strong. Every time I get a kill, I get invisibility for two turns. Yeah, a whole fucking chicken. Oh, it's because the Dark Urge can eat body parts? No way. That's pretty cool. Man, I'm actually wondering if we should use an invisibility pot to get in this front door. You guys think that's a good idea? He's so cute. I know, he's really cute. I'll let you watch the dialogue for this thing. <laughs> he's adorable. You notice a shiver run through his feathered coat. Fear. A desperate longing for the safety of his nest. But his mother is gone. Taken. All that's left are these creatures. You can follow my scent to my camp, the buddy. The tilts his head. He's considering it. He runs away. Only time will tell if he'll reappear. Oh, he's so adorable. I hope you can follow my scent to camp. Oh, these motherfuckers. Is, is it worth talking to them or did we just murder them? Does anyone know? You just murder him? I mean, it works for me. Oh, look at all these paintings. Yo, gold mine. Oh, and cat materials. Key check. Time to get going. Sure, sir. Paintings are good for vendoring. They're worth a lot of money. Well, they're worth a medium amount of money. I want to draw any attention. Oh. Things of the fire snake. Ow. Can't slow down. Any fun dark urge events? Uh, I don't know. I just skip the dialogue usually. Man, those guys have a lot of XP. Oh, there we go. There's a Dark Urge event for you. Nice. All right, I think I will Invispot into the opening room here. Er, right. I'm gonna climb the balcony. I think that's the best idea. No, I don't really need to rest, it looks like. Yeah, they're angry. Um... But 
a good opener? Uh, did the game just fuck me? <laughs> I'm pretty sure the game just fucked me, guys. <laughs> Death won't take me yet. <laughs> what the fuck was that? So much for that invisibility potion. <laughs> Did I fail my athletics check? I think I failed my stealth check. I didn't. I didn't see an athletic one fail. I know, right? I think he. Te I think he teleported over here where this guy is. Pretty sure. Oh, that guy was blocking the ladder. Convenient. Ah, oh, maybe not so convenient. <laughs> I think they're gonna detect me, but that's okay. Oh, I got saved. Man, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Who else wants to climb the ladder? Where'd he go, huh? Where'd he fucking go? <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> Oh, I can't reach him on the ladder. Interesting. All right, time to skulk about. Monk with cloak better than rogue, right? It does seem that way. Well, flawless. So far, so good, except we did waste an invisibility potion. So, is there a way to interact with this vendor? Or are they gonna attack us on sight? It's weird, I see a red mark on my map. Am I not dead? I'd really like to be able to be friends with this vendor. Oh, excuse me. Refresh our key. Yeah, but the vendor is not a goblin. The vendor is an elf. Thank you, Dreamy. Oh, the vendor looks like they're no longer here. Uh, 
Huh. Best be on my way. Man, I don't know if we can beat the owl bear. What's up, six bear? I don't think we can. Seems too too crazy. Strange that I did not get the surprise there. What the fuck? Why did I not get the surprise attack? Tony, I hope you've been well, man. And thank you so much for the 15 months, dude. That was another bullshit stealth mechanic. Okay, well now they're surprised, right? So we shouldn't need to use our key attack. That was a slight misplay. Oopsies. Camera! What are you doing? Climb up the fucking staircase. The camera is battling me. We're just gonna take this uh, opportunity attack here. On my way. Or not. Yeah, sometimes the camera can fights you on the controller. <laughs> it happens. Good evening, Greyblade. Happy Easter, everybody. Zombie Jesus Day, as we call it in these parts. We have saved the Grove yesterday. Which is currently our best run so far. Grove is alive. Well, kind of. Except for everyone that died. What's so bad about the Oliver? It's health and damage, and that there's two of them on this difficulty. Basically, I think they one-shot me. That's like the the first issue. Pretty sure. I mean, I don't really want to fuck with the Oliver at all. <laughs> if you just brought it up to get Oliver revenge. I think it's a bad idea. Yeah. It's just a conversation point. to make the most of these invisibility potions. Can't risk being in open view. One of the owlbears is dead already, you think? Surprised. So, you think the dad owl bear is still there? Into the bloody fray.
Maybe on legendary mode they give you more XP. Oh wow, gut is tough. Shit. Man, it sucks. Why is my accuracy so bad with my spells, guys? Anyone understand why that would happen? It's pretty trash. <laughs> uh, we went tavern brawler. But my accuracy was bad even with my high wisdom before. We were at 18 wisdom and I still couldn't hit shit. Like, we haven't used these spells yet. Our melee attack is good, but not our ranged attack. And I thought wisdom was the stat associated with monk range attacks. Oh! Wow, 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 wow. That was clever. <laughs> Didn't see that coming. <laughs> How did he know I was invisible? <laughs> Cheating fuck. What do I have to lose? Why did I not go invisible there? Because I already was invisible? Guy's got fifty two fucking health. And we are out of key. Show me what you got, buddy, huh? Seven damage. You're gonna have to do better than that. Not good enough, Another buddy. Collect it. It might be useful. Man, is it too late to get branded? I think we fucked up, right? Yeah, Rebel, the problem I have is the opposite. My hit chance is terrible. I'm having the opposite issue. <laughs> With these spells, I'll show you here. I can't, because I'm out of key points. My ranged monk attacks hit rating is, is, is fucked. Yeah, but like, how do I boost my range stuff if it's not wisdom? Because we had 18 wisdom and it was still only like 60% chance. These goblins have blood. Dakota, thank you so much for the sub, man. Thank you guys so much for the resubs. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna punch this guy. You might have something good. Cutting to the chase. Just throw stuff now instead of using my ranged attacks? Okay, well then we need to change our spells. Oh. 
shit, I didn't get whipped on this one. Fuck. I forgot. Oh, this guy's got some stuff. Deals an additional one to six necrotic damage to nearby targets. I got some cool stuff. Can we change our spells? No, we can't, can we? Fuck. So Monk can only change his spells on level up, eh? And you can only pick one to go in and one out? Right, Shu, but I'm confused because we have 16 wisdom, so I would think that the rating would be higher if it's spell save. Imagine if that statue would have killed you. I know, man. We actually got to pass the save roll on it. And did some decent damage. Alright, I think we're gonna try to go kill the uh the ogre and get the misty step necklace next, guys. I'm going to do a long rest. Because we are completely out of key points. You recognize the feathered creature. It's the owlbear cup you rescued. Let's just give him some food. The cup what if he just rip my hand off? <laughs> that would be awesome. <laughs> Try to the feed him my hand and just fucking down. yeets your wrist. Seems he hasn't eaten in some time. Ah. As he approaches, his foot lands on a dry twig, snapping it in half. Oh no! Stupid twig getting me, in, getting in between me and Owlbear friendship. Oops. Oh, that was fine. All right. We got a potion. If everyone else minds their business, I'll be fine. Oof. Level four, huh? Ninety seven health. Yikes. Oh God. Caught trespassing again. You've wandered. No. Out of sight, out of mind. Ah. Here goes nothing, guys. Oh my god, that damage. You picked the wrong fight, friend. Holy shit. You're surprised, you can't do that. Okay, luckily. 
Luckily it whiffed. Oh my god. Ridiculous. Uh, that was absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, that was big damage. Amulet of Misty Staff. Let's go. That could save us in a pinch. is the something what did I discover the pouch okay I don't think we want to go in here right this is like a death trap if I remember correctly. Man, that ogre gave us a fuckload of XP. 75. Okay, where to next, huh? I think we just discovered door tech. Ah, if I go turn base mode, then I get my uh, bonus action unarmed punch. Cool. So then we can break doors easier. Had to be cautious. Okay, fuck that room. This is the goblin stronghold. Yeah, Halston's at the camp already. He shut up after we uh, defeated the grove. All right, time to skulk about. Is this guy good for anything? Place was supposed to be about. I, I, Should have been able to dark urge that guy. More for me. We could go all the way into Act Two for items and XP. Can I go back to Act One though? Because, I mean, I'd like to do it in order, right? That would make sense.
I do think I am going to buy the throw ring real quick. Look for some potion ingredients. Everyone else minds their business. I'll be fine. Run's going good, Itsuki. Real good. Yeah, I'm gonna grab that throw ring since we are currently Devon Brawler. Yeah, we're we're doing good. Save the grove, man. And now we're plundering the goblin uh, stronghold. Oh shit, I missed it on this loop out here, too. Oh, it feels so nice to be able to actually carry stuff, too. Ooh, smoke bomb. Friggin' huge. Tons of smoke bombs. Oh my god. That's so good. Those things are strong. So yeah, we're kind of trying to get to level 5 so we can kill Kaga. Because Kaga apparently has a good ring. I don't think we want to do it before level 5. I mean, we're doing so much damage actually though. Maybe we can kill her right now. I think we can. YOLO. Picks a fight. We got the surprise. Oh, we got a crit. Oh my god, we're so strong. What the fuck, man? Let's not play any games with her at all. <laughs> I think she just gave me 150 XP. Whenever the wear is healed, this we their weapon. Ah, that's not going to work for us. Because we don't use weapons, really. Sad. I only got 150 XP, though, so whatever. Worth. Better than nothing. It'll take a while for us all to recover. Of course. You have the throwing ring, right? All right. Oh my god. <laughs> so much. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We're rich. We're fucking rich, guys. Uh, shitty healing potions. I 
could come in handy, I think. We're looking for some sort of scroll to kill the harpies with, by the way. On a side note. Some sort of buff that will help us against harpies. You know, that could come in handy in a pinch. I don't have that. I'm looking for ingredients. I don't see any Hellfinger stuff. May you keep. Man, none of these rings stack on unarmed stuff, man. Right, he's we're like the only customer this guy has now. <laughs> Everyone else is dead. He's really taking advantage of the situation. <laughs> I'll shop somewhere else. I know. We can't get... we uh, Silence. I don't know what we're going to do for the harpies. Protection from good and evil doesn't work. What's up with this? Is there a light here? So yeah, I don't really have a good strat right now for harpies. Can I brand myself? Have fun with that. <laughs> with haste. Shadow Monk gets silence as a key ability. Maybe we for the harpy fight. Oh shit. Maybe for the Harpy fight, we want to respect Shadow Monk and then pump our wisdom again. Oh god, this guy is fucking terrifying. This is the real fight right here. I didn't mean to aggro them all immediately. Shit. Fuck. Why can I not throw you? Sketchy. It'd be really nice to take out his friends first. If I remember correctly, yeah, this guy is a fucking be wait, legendary action. Wait, what? This is a boss?
What's galvanize? Oh my god, he gives everyone around him extra actions? Uh-uh. Oh, we could throw him? What? So how do I see my percent chance to throw this guy? Anyone know? How do I see my percent chance to throw him? I don't I don't know why I can throw him. I think I needed more than 21 to throw. I guess maybe that's exactly what we need. We need to make sure we throw on him though. I'm not throwing him with like a 60%. We need like an 80%. It's gotta be a way to see, right? Is shove and throw the same percent? I mean, 84 is pretty nice. Can he misty step or anything? The problem is when I click throw, it's doing my menu. I feel like there should be a way to tell. To s select from world. Oh. 95% chance. Fucking eat. What do you mean, fail? What do you mean? 95, buddy. 95. Oh, God. I'm running away. Like, I'm not even running. I'm missing stepping out of here. <laughs> Fuck this. Oh god, I can't get a good misty step angle. Oh man. Fuck. Oh, I should look at the combat log. What happened here? Does anyone know? Can anyone explain this? Infinite jumping might be better. Yeah, I think since I can't get a line of sight, I think you're right. So that's a good call. Oh no. Oh no, we're gonna get, we're gonna take fall damage. Oh God, everything's fucking hitting the fan. Okay, wait, there we go. So what does this say? Why did I miss? Difficulty class zero. Skill check three. Plus five. Strength modifier. How did that miss? Because I'm looking at this. How do I inspect? And it looks like I didn't miss. Oh, shit. 
Well, shouldn't it say I rolled a one? I think we're just gonna get the all the way fucking out of this cave, man. <laughs> all the way. I'm gonna check. Oh no, I can't even. Yeah, let's leave. Does the boss have something that's special that blocks it? It should say though, right? I'll look. It's a good idea. I th you think it would say it there? What's up, Frankie? I mean, it said 95% chance. I must have rolled a one. Getting out of here fast enough. <laughs> Step of the wind dash. <sighs> yeah, I almost got caught in that corner. This is so broken. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> that is, that's not even, we can jump all the way back to camp, man. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that's insane. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> we got some serious hops. Better than nothing. Guy is so scary. Oh, if we could assassinate his little guys, that would be nice. I'm a little bit worried. I don't know where the boss is. Well, shit. Think you can take me on? Twelve to seventeen. I mean, he's not that close. Should be okay. I'm gonna try to own him again. I'm not sure exactly why it didn't work last time. Let's see. Throw, select, open world. 95%. Must've just rolled a one, eh? It's the only thing I can think of. Right? That time it worked. Man, imagine dying to that 95% thrill. <laughs> ah. I'd be so fucked. Oh, he was prone, so he had to skip his turn. Hype. Ah. Uh, is this going to be a big moment for one of our ranged attacks? 25%! These spells are fucking useless, man! 
<laughs> They're so useless! 42 is an unacceptable value! Let's do that. The guy's got to heal. I'm like horrified of getting misty stepped. I'm just assuming every single NPC has misty stepped and they're cheating fucks. Come on, spiders. You got this. Nice. God damn. Well, the dragon punch is good. This one was good because it buffs my unarmed damage. Oh, he's hiding behind some bullshit. That's fucked up. How dare you hide behind some bullshit? Oh, the spiders blinded him. Man, this dude is so ridiculous. Holy shit. See, now we see this move's good. Well, for me, no, 11 damage isn't it? Could have been better, I suppose. All right, he has killed both of the spiders. Right? And there's only two spiders down there? I threw him down there. in that corpse brimming with potent magic fuck yeah fuck yeah we killed the boss i think that was our first legendary boss right i'm a little confused can anyone explain this to me okay it's on now so i should not die Somewhere, I don't know. Maybe it just worked. I don't know. <laughs> I don't get what that was. <laughs> wow, this guy didn't drop jack shit. You gotta cast it? It's only a toggle, Snorkel. I don't know how to cast it. It's slow fall. Maybe it did work. I, don't, I have no idea. I think the first one said that I was going to take 12 damage, right? And then that one was 6, so I think it's working. Well, how the fuck do we get out of here now that I jumped in the hole? Could just miss you, step, eh? Kind of scared of what's in this pit. Did you kill Halston? No, he's chilling in our camp. Stop finding me, camera. Oh. With a flick of the wrist. Oh, that's not bad at all. That's how we get out. Yeah. 
gonna really make me swap my gear for this fucking door? Fine. Oh, this is the hardest mode. It's called honor mode. And this is our farthest run. Probably done like eight runs so far. It's... I can't, I don't really know if that boss was harder than Minthara. So far we've only killed two bosses and I don't even know if, I don't even think Minthara was a boss, right? Because that guy had legendary actions, so. He was a boss. Kind of a pushover, though. <laughs> Since we are, our spec is very strong for him. I'm actually really surprised to be able to throw him in general. Just out of view. It's the only hard guy in here, right? I mean, it's gotta be. That guy was a beast. Stealth God. <laughs> Excuse me? What? <laughs> Pretty sure you didn't see me. <laughs> That's kind of bullshit. Uh, let's kill this guy. Germ Forge, yeah. I mean, there's a lot of bosses, really. We could do. I think harpies make sense next. Wow, this guy only has 10 health? What the fuck? What's up, Underdog? We out here on our personal best run right now. Feels good. This boyo's got some health. Not enough. How did I just take damage? The fuck was that? <laughs> Flaming fists. Classic gnome monk, right? So, you're 100% sure that Shadow Monk gets silence, by the way? Someone was saying that. That sounds like a good harpy strat. Crank wisdom, go shadow monk, beat harpies.
At level four? Okay. I think that's the plan. I'm not sure if there's anything else in here to do. I mean, there's a loot cache, right? We could kill the priestess, maybe? We killed the ogre already? Oh, should we just got a key? Salon's dream. The fuck is that? Possibly falls asleep. That sounds like so terrible. <laughs> Whoa. The wearer gains advantage on melee attack rolls while surrounded by two or more foes. But two armor class. I think I'd rather take the armor class, eh? Oh, and only on allies? They're talking about the necklace. Ah. Vendor trash. Bunch of vendor trash. I mean, maybe if we really, really need to, like, nuke someone. Ha! You planning on getting buffs from people in your camp? Nah. This thing not die. <laughs> Fucking annoying ass. <laughs> well, can you throw it? Ooh, when the warrior stands in water, it becomes electrified. It's interesting. We also have the electrocutioner ring. That's a good point too, Rusty. I mean, we would have to be able to. It would have to be like guaranteed to kill them. Those gloves. I mean, we are doing a lot of damage. Oh, wow, 20 XP for that. <laughs> Where's the priestess? Isn't there, like, a lady that wants to kill me or something? I don't know how to get to her. Maybe she's in here. Softer than a whisper. Killed gut already. Yeah, but isn't the lady that brand me someplace? Maybe we're done with it. Beastmaster's chain. Oh, weird. So this implies Halson was able to escape by himself, huh? What Chad? 
He just turned into a bear and just ripped all this shit apart. Dobby? All right, I think that's as much goblin stronghold as I can handle. Let's get the fuck out and kill some harpies. Before I forget, though, we are going to go buy a more strength potions. Hopefully she's got another great healing potion also. Hag actually kind of useful. I'm <laughs> not going to lie. <laughs> Hello, what do you say? Want me to take care of the little bugger? Nice. The hag is working well. Ah. Yeah, she's she's kind of nice. <laughs> I kind of don't want to kill her. But I do want to kill her because I want to get that hair. That's going to be difficult. The first time I split you. Awkward. Thy wheel of fate turn. Dost thou require a new ally? As thou. Pickle man, thank you for the two years. Soon, happy Sunday. Think, but well, we didn't want fifteen constitution. Yeah. Happy Sunday, pickle. We're gonna respect specifically to kill the harpies here. Cool, we're using every single monk spec so far. Yeah. Oh wow, I can cast darkness also. Just to make extra sure we don't get fucked by these, we're taking the resilience and the wisdom as well. And we are going to throw this ring on that may or may not do anything. <laughs> but we're still going to throw it on for, you know, just clear conscience. Higher level Shadow Monk is pretty cool. They get the ability to teleport between shadowed areas. That's kind of cool. Why fix the thing when not broken? Um, this is called optimization. And we're optimizing against Harpy's charm. Mm, Harpies haven't finished her run yet, but that's because we had silence. We only fought them one time, and we had silence. So that's why we're respecking. This is the only way we can get the Mon class silence. The cub holds out his leg, revealing a ragged wound.
So that's why, Mesh, we're respecting for it. That's the strategy that worked last time. It's like a five versus one against monstrosity, so better safe than sorry. As the wound closes, the cup begins to... And they hit hard. And last time we had a spirit weapon to actually absorb a lot of the damage the harpies were doing. We don't have that this time. We're solo. <sighs> You know, it's weird that once you save the Emerald Grove, it should just, like, open. Oh, shit. It should open like a teleport inside the grove. <laughs> Missing all that strength now. Oh my god. We're so cucumbered. It's ridiculous. There we go. Oh, I could have thrown the strength stick on to move there. Yeah, I don't want to forget it for the harpy fight though. So we're going to use a Peerless Focus Potion, too, for this fight. I believe that's the optimal drink. It'll take a while for us all to... Of course. Man, I, I wish I had another mirror image. Scroll. I think I used them all. May you keep... Does anyone know if there's a specific vendor to, to sell the mirror image? Because that would be nice. I gotta pee. Anywhere we could scoop a mirror image? Scroll for this fight? I wonder if scrolls are like randomly generated in merchants, like their weapons. Cause what's nice about mirror images, it doesn't take concentration. This guy's the best chances of a mirror image scroll. Fuck. Um. Let's see some of this. We should cat we should precast a bunch of shit. <laughs> that could be good for a final blow against that one harpy that's singing, right? And it gives us access to Sonic Backslash.
Does mage armor help? Does it brings armor. It brings your. It says something about plus dex modifier. The fuck are you? Okay, so finally go. Mage armor ruins the monks and armor bonus. Okay. Alright, we're gonna precast some shit. Wait, this only lasts one turn? Am I, am I reading that correctly? We got, we got the bone, we got the initiative here. Surprisingly. Damn, I should have cast that first too, fuck. Oh, we got good movements. Man, we look cool with all these bubbles. <laughs> the bubbles. Oh, the crit. The kid's not here because we conquered. Well, we rescued the grove, and I guess all the tieflings went away. Wow, that did 10 damage to it. Since That's insane. Yo, fire bubble rope is sick. Did it only work once? Maybe they missed. That doesn't count. Fuck, this is going pretty good. It only counters on a successful hit. Okay. Wow, that's so nice though, actually. Holy fuck. Um, let's... Let's drink a big potion first. Or a little potion? Let's attack first and see. Oh, we're losing so much damage now. Oh, that's fucking eighty-eight percent. Okay, that's that's time for a big potion. <gasps> Wait, that was my bonus move. Oh no, I fucked up. I fucked up bad. Uh oh. Maybe I should use this. Just in case, huh? Four to 11. I think we should use this, huh? I really fucked that turn up. It's not concentrating or anything, is it? No.
Well, that just saved our life. <laughs> that was a good play. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh my God. Holy fuck, these harpies are nasty. No, I'm not gonna throw a potion at my feet. That shit's too inconsistent for me. Ah, we actually broke our silence too. Please get hit. This doesn't mean I missed, right? This is rolling for a crit, correct? Yeah, we've everyone's been critting us this fight. It's been really scary. Okay, I hit already. Let's go. Yeah, I'm gonna GTF out the fuck out of here. <laughs> that was so sad. <laughs> Oh my god, that was so sketch. How many crits happened? So many crits. All of the fucking crits. All of them. <laughs> Let's not use the bonus action. What is for the harvest? <laughs> Wait, you're alive still? Okay, thank God. <laughs> Started wobbling around. My God, what a what a near disaster, guys. Like, fuck, these harpies are strong. <laughs> <laughs> we almost lost the run there. Man, that psionic power saved us so hard. And it actually had really good synergy with the fire shield, too. <laughs> oh, there's a the little kid. Jesus Christ, I can't believe we almost died to that. That was fucking wild. I was so fucking cursed. Just crazy. <laughs> Goblin clamp is cleared out. I don't have, I don't know what's next now. Respect the tavern brawler probably. I don't know what we do next, guys. All ideas are welcome. Yeah, this is the farthest we've gotten uh, by a considerable margin, too. Are we ready for the Underdark? So we haven't messed around with hyenas yet. Um. Ow. How am I silenced? What? Why am I silenced? Is it supposed to be a toggle? I want to see if I know how this works, this slow fall. Okay, that's 15 damage. Okay, slow fall is kind of cool. Yeah, hyenas are available. We've already fucked up the way to turn the boss to our side. You can get a ton of XP for just going to the Gith Reach. That sounds good. Honestly, we really want to try to get level five. 
That that's I've, that's that's all we want to do right now. That's optimal. Man, I hope this silence or isn't gonna like be honest the whole game. Why am I silenced? Maybe it's some sort of shadow monk passive thing. Oh. <gasps> Yo, what's happening? Why am I silenced? The fuck? Breathe quiet. Move with care. Try a long rest? We'll try a partial rest first. I can't cast a spell. Oh, it might have fixed it. I can't cast a spell because I'm silenced. This is what I tried to do. <laughs> I tried to cast silence again. <laughs> a hundred turns. <laughs> oh, maybe it fixed because it was a hundred turns and then we rested. Phew. <laughs> Phew, I think we fixed it. <laughs> we just hit. Nice. <laughs> Imagine our run dies. Maybe we're permanently silenced. My wheel, <laughs> dost thou require a new ally? As thou oh my god. What a disaster. Okay. We're going back to Avern Brawler. I was trying to think of this not more optimal build. No, nah, we're gonna be Tavern Brawler and just chug the fuck out of Elixir of Hill potions. That's what we've been doing all day, respective of the before we went to the goblin camp today, and it's been working really well. Oh wait, wait, wait. We get to pick a level of constitution or strength. We go Tavern Brawler, so we want fifteen. That looks good. So, I mean, I really like Elemental Monk. But what would be the difference here? And all, what's the pros and cons versus Way of the Open Hand? So there's this one elemental monk spell that I like that adds fire damage to my next unarmed attack. Which has been sick. Unfortunately, for some reason, all my other elemental monk shit can't hit worth a crap, though. I mean, it's basically unusable.
I might just stick with elemental because I like it. I don't really need this stuff. Let's we'll stick with this because I'm enjoying it. And we're going to pick different spells because for some reason I, I can't hit any of these ranged ones. Can I tell like why this one is melee and the other are ranged, guys? This doesn't make sense to me. Can you fall from a, from afar, right? Well, this one gives me 95% accuracy with Tavern Brawler. But the other ones that hit foe from far don't ever hit. Yeah, I tried Water Whip, but I can't hit anything with it because it's got about a 50% fucking accuracy. Well, that's it's, that's our next melee attack, Smully. I don't know why it says different on the left side than the right side. Yeah, only some of them count as an armed. Is it just the range? Why? You'd think it would explain this better. Maybe six is considered melee and that's that's it. Because, yeah, this one is just a whiff machine. That's a nine range. This one's nine range. They don't do anything but whiff. So if that's six, then maybe we should bring the Fist of the, of the Four Thunders. It won't be an attack roll, but it says these powers also trigger unarmed strikes. I don't really understand what you mean. Yeah, I get that it's just like Thunder Wave and this is just Chromatic Orb. Unsaved targets still take half damage. You know what? That might be really nice to use as like a pseudo melee magic missile, right? Right? When we like really need to kill something. It's also AOE, right? You respect that I'm trying to make this awful subclass work? I mean, it's carried us to the PB so far, though. You know, Troy? Like, this shit is so strong because it adds 1 to 4 damage to Flurry of Fists, whatever that shit's called. So, I mean, buffing our Flurry bonus hit is, like, not bad, in my opinion. So I'm, like, missing out. Alright, we're gonna try sweeping cinder strikes. Should we use this so we don't have to use our disengage? The damage is just so bad though. I mean, I'm leaning towards the Four Thunders. <sighs> but knocking people is so inconsistent with Thunder Wave, right? It could help in a pinch, though, if we get, like, super ambushed, right?
This is nice because we don't have to use disengage and we can still do damage. I'm leaning towards shocking touch. Shoving them away also does disengage things. Yeah, but shoving them away is a constitution rule. Like Rusty brought up, which is not very consistent. Where shocking grasp will just tell me 95% chance to hit, right? So 95% chance disengage. Rather than rolling against someone's constitution and, and praying. Plus, we got an AoE. We didn't have an AoE last time. I don't really need an AoE this time. Let's do it. And we're definitely taking Tavern Brawler, because that shit is fucking ridiculous. Wait, Shocking Grasp is totally useless. Why would you waste a key point on something that does less damage than a punch when you could Step of the Wind disengage? Because Step of the Wind disengage is a bonus action, right? So it's nice to have options. Right, because now I could touch of the storm into Wind Dash, for example. Shocking does use a key. Only one. I could see that being useful. Or you could use the save a key point and only disengage. Well, first off, disengage doesn't give us dash, though. So my, my logic is like, we have a super oh shit moment against the boss. Shocking grass. Dash. Garen fucking teed. We get the fuck out of there. I know we can hop. We can hop this stupid far, but overkill. It's not bad. Uzi, happy Easter, man. I don't know if Shocking Grasp does more damage to people that are wet. I, th I think it creates a surface, maybe? Open hand gets flurry of blows, push, topple, and stagger. Yeah. Yeah, I get you, but... I mean, they roll saves constantly against that shit, though. Like, one doesn't simply topple an enemy, you know? I, I wish. I'm gonna kill all the survivors in the Emerald Grove while we figure out the next plan of action here. Ah, cheers to you, Uzi, man. Is it gonna cost us XP later if we finish off the rest of the grove? I mean... There's not much left of the grove. <laughs> oh my god, it's fucking... We need to go sell some shit. I'm pretty sure all of the important people in the grove have already died in the war, okay? 
I think this all is just a few like random nobodies here. I killed Kaga already. Because I thought I could use the necklace. Turns out I couldn't. It buffs weapon attacks, but it was really 150 XPs. It'll take a while for us all to recover. Of course. <laughs> I called that worth. I think basically we already killed everyone important. Why not finish him off? God, we have way too much shit here. Jesus Christ. Should actually put some stuff in our camp chest that I'm using as situational. Yeah, this is sad. Weapon becomes coded. That's worthless, eh? What if I give Halson his pipe? Do you have any new scrolls? Don't fucking look like it. May you keep. Um, I th we're like, what is this day five? About, you know, full like six to eight hour streams. And this is the only run that has survived the attack on the Grove so far. Mithrandra, man. Mithrandra's a fucking bitch. Hold person sucks. The second best run we had was a cleric. A very heavy armor cleric. Uh, which died to Mithrandra in this fight up here. Mithrandra did the old misty step hold person one shot combo so since that was the pb and that's how it died we went for a wisdom class which i opted for gnome monk because gnome intelligence gives us wisdom saves which are what we died from hold person and then we went monk because it kind of synergized with wisdom set as well and uh We've been fucking kicking ass on this build so far. We did almost die to the Harpies, though, just like 20 minutes ago. Fucking Harpies are strong as shit. Yeah, we've had a ton of deaths, though. It's been a huge learning experience. Like, I think the first one died in the Nautiloid spaceship. <laughs> because on Honor Mode, that fucking Mind Flare gets wrecked so fast. Elixir of giant strength, let's go. But yeah, probably like maybe 10 failed runs that got absolutely fucking nowhere and have been learning experiences. Pizza, stop it. Died to, like, dialogue a couple times. Failed checks. Shit like that. Mm, all right. Don't want to draw any attention. Can't risk being in open view. I need to tidy up these gears in a quick second. That'll be our utility. All 
that ah, looks a little bit better. What do I have to lose? Are these ruins? I don't know. They look like XP. Where are you going? Where are you going? What's up for discussion? What the fuck is this about? What do I have to lose? Where is everyone running? That guy just ran into the abyss. The fuck? Oh, Shalalagla. Anything but Shalalagla. Twenty XP, I'll take it. Very well. Yeah, I don't know what these are. Drew, that looks like some sort of. I don't know. They look like scrubs. Don't run away! I need your delicious XP. You're making this harder than it needs to be. <laughs> what is this guy doing? Oh, that's the guy we saved! Maybe he'll give us XP. Wait, why am I only having 60% hits? Oh, I forgot to drink my strength potion. Shit. That's why we're whiffing constantly. Uh, is it worth drinking one right now? Yeah, we got a lot of key left. We shouldn't need to rest soon. Adventurous sleeps soundly. Huh? The adventurous sleeps soundly. His okay, you fucking steady. sleeping? His wounds What's expertly bandaged. What the fuck are you talking about? I mean, sleep soundly. No one in here to murder? Not gonna murder you. Just show up. Come here. Hey, 44 bucks, so take it. Yeah, we might want to leave that guy alive, actually. Ha! Dark urge, bitch. I get these urges, guys. Okay, it's part of my role play. Bloodthirst. I was one whole XP killing that squirrel. Okay, this is the only one that we can't kill. He's off limits. Let's go fuck with some druids, huh? I think we could take them. Maybe. They've killed me in the past. But Kaga's isolated. She's dead already, so isn't she the strong one? Looks very winnable. Who do you guys think is the biggest threat here? Nah, Hassan's at her camp chilling. Yeah, might as well go kill this bear. He seems isolated. Mm. Don't hurt me. I'll show you. I just want 
You're not allowed to run for help. You're not allowed. Come back here. Thank you first. Blah. GG bear. GG. All right, who's next? Who wants some? <laughs> I don't need any attention right now. Let's get in and out. <laughs> we can't keep this guy so fucking far. Uh, I think we'll just punch his nuts off. Hey, you good? Violence isn't tolerated in these parts. Attack! Oh, I didn't think it's surprised. I don't understand. Was I not sneaking? He's made a grave mistake. Blah. Mm. Need to find a way forward. Uh oh. That's not great. Because dialogue? That's stupid. Is there not a way to avoid that situation? <laughs> the bear was so silly there. Did you guys see that? He was like... <sighs> has gone too far. I don't want to talk. Why I can't? Dance. You're ruining everything. Oh, okay. Never mind. That time was fine. Wow. <laughs> Why did I not go invisible? I'm counting on this mechanic. Can you please let me go invisible? Oh, shit. We murdered her so fast. No one even saw. <laughs> ah, runs in fire. What do you mean murder is forbidden? How can murder be forbidden? Hey oh, fuck your blur. You're next, buddy. Okay, we're out of super moves now, so we gotta... Why are you taking the derpiest possible route? You know what? I'm okay with that route. Actually. Ah, oh, shit. You look like free invisibility. You looking like a snack, buddy. <laughs> what? What, 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 what? That's not good. We just missed a 95% attack. That's very bad. Dashing is good. We want to see dashing. Take cure. Yes, heal yourself. That is okay with me. Wow. Oh, let's get the fuck out of here. something to ask what do you want to ask how to survive the reckoning regression has yo this shit needs to stop you're ruining my fucking plants why do they keep trying to be my friend just fucking die for fuck's sake you're ruining my invisibility memes is there no way to bypass this stupid dialogue bullshit trash that's fucking up my entire strategy? Is there like an option to turn talking off or something? Because they're, they're fucking me up with this shit. 
They're like literally talking themselves out of death. You think silence is gonna work on me? <laughs> Monk shit. I want to save that guy. He looks like invisibility. Wow, I want to see our new spells. 3 to 18, 1 to 10. Put range on that. It's not great. Wow. An arm strike. Open fist. Go see what happened. They got murdered. Oh no. Not the murdering. You're mine, bitch. Get fucking one shot, scrub. They don't even know they're dead. Died so fast, don't even know they're dead. Blah. Now we really dark urgent. to fight. Yo, this shit's so fucking annoying. <laughs> Try stealthing next time or something. Ninety-five percent misses. This is the whole reason we went tavern brawler because ninety-five percent chance should not be a fifty percent chance to hit. Okay, you're fucking up. <laughs> Fucking 95% chance of these nuts in your mouth. Fucking stupid ass fucking druids. You're not the smartest one, are you, huh? Wow, what are you doing? What do you mean you can't reach him? Are you fucking stupid? I give you all this movement speed and you can't fucking... Go through three inches of fucking water? Oh, that guy's just gonna go back to sleep after all of his friends got ruthlessly murdered in front of him. <laughs> Don't seem like the smartest play to me. But I'll allow it. What is seeing me here? Like, what? <gasps> is this stupid bird? What? If everyone else minds their business, I'll be fine. Oh, my hand slipped. Stop, bird! Stop living! The fuck? Another day, another fight. <laughs> There you go. Need to find a way forward. Not a boy. Man, that bird had a lot of blood inside. Oh, I could have thrown the bird against the wall. Yo, I'm gonna throw the bird at the bear for the ultimate no, disrespect. Ah, there's your friend. There's your fucking friend. What do you think about that bear? Did I miss the bear with a 99% chance? I see that right. Can I help him? You out of there. Let's help him. What does this mean? Hello. He forgot how to fly. <laughs> Why isn't the bear going back to sleep? Go to sleep. No, oh, I kind of feel bad now. The bear's kind of cute. <laughs> What's up, Umu? <laughs> what do we have here? All right, GG. 
Man, I'm dirging. I'm dirging. Dirging all over the fucking druid grove. Hooah! Man, we almost went hitless there, didn't we? Did I get a decent amount? I feel like I got a decent amount of XP for that, actually. Not bad. Man, these guys love goo berries. That's a lot of goo. Well, you can tell they died because they didn't have any fucking good loot or magic weapons. Maybe Damn, these bows are valuable. No, Halsum's not dead. He's in my camp. I wonder what he's going to say when we tell him we murdered all of his friends. I do have his best smoking pipe, though. So maybe he'll just kind of gloss over the, the murdering his friends part. Mm. Oh, I hope he doesn't attack me when I go to rest. I feel like we need to go rest now. We're out of, out of key. Just in case, we'll rest first, and then we'll talk to Halson and see what what he has to say about it. More different than I thought. Either you or your parasite. All right, keep the chat. That a boy will. You don't want to fight Halson? Why not? Is he actually so strong? Is he stronger than Kaga? He can solo a significant portion of the goblin camp. Olsen has lightning strike. What level is he? He only has 38 HP. What, is he going to turn into a bear and have like 200? Father's blessings to you. How will the girl fare without you? Hopefully. I chosen a successor as first druid, Francesca of the High Forest. I sent a bird to summon her. Oh, <laughs> well, the bird! Oh no! <laughs> Who? Precisely. Who indeed? You the don't bird know I yeeted a bunch. The, the grove needs to move beyond the mistakes of the past. What it needs is an unknown quantity. This is why I chose Francesca. She will restore... Sounds like the girl will be in good hands. <laughs> Can't risk being in open view. Is he gonna turn on me? Should we just kill him preemptively? This got me a little worried about Halson. A little bit. I don't need any attention right now. Okay. Look away, Wolfie. Oh, 
violent behavior is proving unpopular. Time to press ahead. Oh, cool. Now we can take the statue. 350 bucks, eh? Let's go. <laughs> I don't know why. Here we go again. <laughs> we'll let the bird live this time. Nature plus one, what a brock of shit. Actually, the most evil way to do with the druids is save them and then give them hope uh, for a better future. And then murder them and throw birds at them. Throwing birds at them is definitely the... <laughs> I should speak up. <laughs> the worst thing you can do to the truth. <laughs> just, just chunking birds at druids. <laughs> Got all the goodies in here. It would have been funnier if we could have brought uh, Kaga back to life with the anime dead scroll. Too, and just showed him the true, the true fury of Kaga. It's the only way we could have played that better. All right, I think the grove has been cleansed. Let's go make sure the trader's okay. Man, that was a lot of XP. What else can we cleanse? Oh, we might be able to cleanse Joaquin's rest. The fireplace. I don't think there's many people left there to cleanse. As long as the merchant's okay with the murdering, we're good. Looks like he is. The very last person alive here. It'll take a while for us all to recover, but you've helped us take the first step. <laughs> Boy, I wouldn't go down to the grove part. Of course. I <laughs> see you. <laughs> <sighs> Don't go down that road over there. Check this guy for scrolls. That could come in handy for the Urim Forge or whatever. May right. you keep. Go up here. 
We'd do a little murder. Oh yeah, something about the Gethrenki quiche just going there gives us XP. That sounds like a kind of a good idea. What's our build like? We are Elemental Monk right now. So we, we be punching. We punching real hard. Excellent armor. Strange place to find it. On a corpse. I guess. There's some decent monk armor. Oh yeah, there is. Yeah, thank you, Mencha. It's a, it's a good build. Does going to the Gathriki crash uh, fuck anything up? Can we mess with these dragon dudes over here, guys? Are we that strong yet? I don't know how strong these guys are. Time to get going. Hell no. What are, what's the next plan? What are we doing next? We already did the stuff that going to the crease could mess up. Mess up. Underdark? Well, I would like that monk armor. I think I know what you're talking about. The one that gives us a dex modifier or something like that? That sounds really nice. What's up, Barely? Oh, uh, we are transi transitioning to murder hobo right now as we have gotten very strong very, very suddenly. So how do I get to the Gathriki Kishé? Is it past the dragon people that you said I'm not strong enough to fight? I don't think we want to try a hag yet. What about robot skeleton? I would really like that full potion heal necklace, James. I would. You think we can? I don't think we can tussle with an owl bear, eh? I'm actually curious to go and explore the owl bear real quick, though. Because we have the baby in our camp. So I wonder if there actually is no more owl bears. by goblins how cruel no there are no more olivers oh shit i think i sold the parts of the broken spear so i couldn't get the inspiration from it talk or the quest an owlbear egg these are supposed to be worth a fortune Pretty sure.
Maybe it's in my camp. <laughs> I can't stop you from. Man, well, this. Is, you, you got, you, okay, I was gonna say you're gonna have to die, so that that solves that issue. It's fine. Will is starting to talk too much. <laughs> I was gonna kill him right there. Mm, I don't have it there. I guess we'll check the grove real quick. Oh, why? You would have it. It's most likely guy. Focus my there's. This game is on on PC PC also barely, and it's 100% must buy in my opinion. You tried to use that spear from inside and rolled to poke my own eye on a hit. No way. What? That can happen? <laughs> if it's not fixed, if you used it broken? <laughs> That's pretty awesome. All right, keep your eyes peeled for the spear. It'll take a while for us all to recover. Of course. I don't think it's here. Fuck, what did I do with that thing? It must be gone now. Ah, uh, rip. May you keep. I definitely prefer this Diablo to Diablo, but they're very different games. Yeah, you're right, Spots. The mom is dead. <sighs> All right, let's go try to get past. Actually, let's go try to kill some hyenas. Seems almost too big to take flight. What are we looking at? Oh. Who is this? No, the dad didn't show up either. What are you doing? Hold up before they see you, Mark Gresham. Got more important things to watch. That lot are swarm. I'm going to find. I doubt a fight against them would go your way. Nobody. Do we want to keep her alive? Rasting fool, trying to stay alive. What? I go my own way, alone. Rag. That's it. I'm getting out of here. Moving in. This is weird. Oh my god, how far can you run? Farther than my hobbit ass. No. Wait, why can't I move? Oh, I used the wrong one. I'm, I am kind of want to remove that one from my wheel. That's like... Ah! Oh, what fucking garbage? Yeah, this just got to go. Fucking A. I missed out on XP. Feels bad, yeah. 
just kind of disappeared like poof. Out of sight, out of mind. I don't even know if there are hyenas over here. I think they're all in the cave. Oh, never mind. I see something. Man, they look kind of tough, too. surprised. Do they spawn more? Wait. I know the ones down there got ripped out of the body, but... These ones can they spawn more? No time for mercy. Oh, hey. Holy fuck, we are so strong, it's actually insane. <laughs> This is fucking wild. Buffing a lot. Oh, yeah, those guys are scary. Shit. Those all would have hit, we might have died. <laughs> kind of scary, actually. Hyena year is so valuable. Mm, that's short. Time to get going. All right, time to skulk about. I think that's all of them now, except for they're all in the cave with the boss. Yeah, the ears are super good. The beautiful bro you hear what you watch with her darling pups will not be of her own species. No. How? Oh wow! We get minus one strength because of our base stats, huh? Including hyenas. Weird. Don't. Those rolls, man. <laughs> Those are fucking rolls. <laughs> a one and a two. <laughs> oh my god, I don't think I ever seen that before. I mean, do we want to waste an ins use an inspiration here? 
I feel like we're fine, right? Unless they have initiative on me. If this is going to give them initiative because they're ambushing me. We don't want that then. No, we don't want a surprise. And what's up, Gomer? Oh, okay. We, well, we went a 1 and a 2 and then a 19 and a 20. What are the fucking chances? That's got to be like a 1 in a billion chance. You a sweet strike against Tusca. <laughs> Those were the Yikes. craziest rolls ever. Whatever horrific creature. That was wild. We don't we definitely want to kill this one. One day I'll catch a break. Yeah, 20 XP a pop. It's pretty nice. Damn knows are everywhere. Okay, they're not that strong. Should be okay. Shit, he's gonna detect me. I guess the corpse was in the way. <laughs> Trying to conserve my key here. Thanks, Azazel. Okay. Oh, we are so we are getting so close. So try to sneak past the Githrenki fight. Will we miss out on the option to actually do the fight if we sneak past all those guys? It is super fun, Turtle. Yeah, Monka is going really well. A happy Easter, guys. I will miss out on the fight. What's in here? You think he are... are strong. <laughs> They're a stupid misty step. What else can they do? We did pick up Tavern Brawler, yeah. We've actually been every single type of monk today, which has been actually a lot of fun. We started the stream as Elemental. Then we went Tavern Brawler for the dwar the Goblin Stronghold so we could throw people. We, we yeeted the boss into the spider pit. Which is really, really good. <laughs> he didn't even touch us. Um, and then, for the Harpy fight, we respect the Shadow Monk. Because they get silence. We almost died in the Harpy fight. Technically, we actually did die. But I used um, Survival Instinct. We actually reached 0 <laughs> HP in the Survival... Both her Harpies crit me in the same turn. Rocking Survival Instinct. And we got resurrected then and killed them. It was that fucking close, man. It was, it was fuck. It's been the uh, actual closest death on the run so far. And then we respect back to Tavern Brawler. Now. They hit four times. Do they actually have hold person, Githronki? 
No, Luke, we don't want the lightning charge gloves because we get two armor class out of our current gloves. We don't want to lose armor. Say not fight them. You think the null fight in the cave with the boss is easier than this fight? The method fight in the swamp is actually not a bad idea. That's probably the easiest fight, right? I can't remember. Those guys have a meme, though, don't they? Maybe that's the best play. We're really close right now. We've already went down into the Underdark. Current options, skip Githrinki to go to the Creech, Swarm, Underdark, Knolls, or, or, or kill Githrinki, remember that? That's still an option. Why is that now listed in the options? You really think they're gonna kill me? Yes. How many shells do they have? I mean, if we can just, they can't see invisibility, right? Underdark boat fight. I don't even see him. Wait, did we? Did they? Are they just not even an option anymore? Drop your weapon. Our feet. This is no. Stop wasting time. Of course. No excuse. Our queen watches. Facing that lot would be suicide. At least. You're so wrong. Oh, <gasps> 68 health. Okay, we're not. No. Oh. The music is freaking me out. Let's go to the swamp. I think swamp ain't a bad call. Should I kill these guys? Is there anything good? Out of killing them? Just killing them make the hag angry. Yeah, the hag is kind of really useful right now because she keeps giving us delicious elixirs. Killing them won't make the hag angry. Are they harder, or do you think the methods are harder? They have whole man. Everything has whole person. It's so fucked. <laughs> are methods monstrosities or fey or what? I realize now we forgot to get that initiative bow. Fuck. Methods explode? Yeah, 58 health looks strong. What kind of enemies are methods, guys? Should I use a scroll of good and evil? We are currently tavern brawler. Elemental. We can 
let's rock that, eh? Skull of Flaming Orb. I think it's a concentration, though, right? Yeah. They put a speed debuff on you also. Oh god, stop! I want to try to jump, but let's study their path for a sec. Because jumping seems to alert people. It's very loud. That's a pretty good first round. <laughs> we might want a long rest for this, right? So we have full key. Let's see if we can assassinate a couple. We got one more turn of invisibility. Fifty four health. Is it these ones that explode or these ones that explode? Flying ones. I'm gonna try to burst this tree guy down. Oh God, why does it not stop sometimes? It is, Calyx, it is. Everyone should buy this game. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's got something for everybody. Let's get this over with. Really? It said I could do it. No, I can't do it. That's fucking bullshit. Now we're in a bad spot. I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. <laughs> uh, let's, let's go wrong rest. <laughs> Oh, move closer is easier said than done when you got these patrols that are like randomly freezing in time and randomly unfreezing in time. Well, our boots are really good for jumping, so I don't really want to change boots. Well, maybe here they're better. I don't think I bought them, actually. Lucky, I remember to use that. To be cautious. Oh, 
I think I'm gonna try to take out these methods first. Just like that. No time for mercy. No one got surprised. Huh. That's not great. Very well. Wait, they summon them too? Wait a second. Uh oh. Will they despawn when I kill the, fa the papa? Oh, I hope the fuck. They will not? Okay, they don't have shit for health, though. Man, I can't sneak up on these? Shit. It's a problem because of the death burst. But we'll get invisibility. Or the death burst will blow up after my invisibility kicks in. Oh no. Hopefully these ones don't die. Wait, okay. Hopefully these ones don't explode. Oh my God, they all explode. Even when they die, even when they get despawned, they explode? Okay, we can bring this back. So we are super slowed right now. So what I have to do here, what is the death burst radius? Within two meters. Is that two meters guys? Because I need to invis, and then I need to escape. <laughs> Not looking great here. Is that two meters? I hope this is two meters, guys. Two to five damage or health. You can check if they're two meters away. I don't know where you guys are seeing that.
Okay, well, fortunately, it was two meters. Phew. That was scary, man. <laughs> that was scary as hell. Jeez. Man, they're fucking spooky. We're actually uh, on on PC. I just like using controller. I'm sure must. Better than nothing. I think take this guy out. Honestly, man, maybe the methods are more dangerous. Maybe we should actually go for the method. Don't look like it's coming over here. It's gonna try and blow him up. Ah, it'll work pretty nicely. That's how we got surprised. step forward. Man, they really do have high defense. <laughs> Holy fuck. Yeah, I think fire actually cancels their um, regen. Nah, not that they're on fire, but... I'm not sure how it works. I think this is a burning hands moment, eh? Oh, fire destroys the vines, gotcha. First time we're using it. Doesn't seem very good. <laughs> I mean, actually, what did that do? Eight damage. <sighs> Math damage. Not that great. Honestly. I wonder, I want to look at the combat journal exactly. Why did it do so little damage to the method? Can anyone explain this to me in human terms? I rolled a, an 11 and it did, it only did five damage. Off an 11 roll. Uh, 
Ah, uh, here it is. Oh God. <laughs> Divided by two because of the save. Okay, so long story short, it got it got a save. So it did half damage. And it is So my proficiency against it was thirteen, but its deck save against it was fourteen something. That's how it rolled the save. I'm trying to learn, okay? Is that correct? My my power of it was 13, but its dex modifier was 14. It rolled a 13, yeah, yeah. So chances of it rolling a 13 again are not fantastic. But we'd only do like, I don't know. Is it worth to do it again? I don't know. Oh man, we blew all of our key that quick, huh? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Oopsies. Uh. See, who needs anti-movement impeding boots when you can jump over a fucking rainbow, you know? Thank you for moving away from me, because that's like my big concern. Seventy-five percent chance to miss must have been what happened there. Fire shield could actually really backfire here, huh? I mean, I can't. Wow. Why? Uh, I got a solution to this. <laughs> I'd like to see a blow me up now, buddy. You fucking asshole. A <laughs> big win for throw. <laughs> big win for throw. Oh my gosh, this guy's gonna explode me, and I can't kill his friend. What if I just throw his exploding friend at him and kill him? Perfect. That was the best throw of the... That was a certified tavern brawler moment. A absolutely. That was by far the best throw of the game so far. Strategically, at least. I was just thinking if I was gonna long rest after this fight, we're gonna short rest for sure. So let's let's just throw some alchemist fire at this guy. I think I got a good amount of it. Oh, we got eleven. Seems like the best way. Seems solid. This guy just ass through fire. Oh. 
Wow, I can throw this guy? I can throw a literal fucking tree? Oh, 72% chance. Let's go. Not bad. Not bad. Hell yes. Whoops. Maybe we should have done this before we murdered Kaiga, huh? mean we should go and think about killing the lightning boss because I don't want to lose the two armor class but I believe the monk armor that we can get will help us maybe we can stand a chance against lightning boss the robots Throwing is also considered unarmed. So what we could do is we could bring some water barrels. Because I'm not a barrel mancer, but I feel like we could bring a water barrel to that fight. Maybe. Maybe that's the same as barrel mancing. Pretty much. Because we could electrify the whole terrain up there. It's an idea of an approach to the fight. Yeah, that's true. We have water bottles, and then we can say it's not barrel mancing, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I just kind of refuse to use barrel mancy. Oh no, dreamy. That's that's sad. I am sorry to hear that. No. Well, we can throw them out the window, I think, Shu. But it's not a guaranteed kill. He can also leave combat. Right? Yeah, shoot, I, I agree with that. And we don't actually even need barrels. We can just bring water. I didn't think about that. Something over So we're, we really are close to five, man. How can we push the five? Feather fall and jump down after you push him out the window to one versus one him outside the tower. You know, that is actually a very good idea, so Black. Can we jump through the window? I mean, if we can push him through the window, you think we can jump through it?
Where is this location? Uh, this big ass island. We just need a little bit of XP, guys, to get to level 5, and then we can go kill some bosses. I guess we're gonna go for the quiche. I thought there was like a treasure out here. How much of the Underdark have we done? Not much. I figured it was harder down there than up, up top. I don't know if that's true. Is there like anything easy in the Underdark? People who said this won't piss off the hag. Oh, these guys have a whole person. God. We'll just kill the sages first. Good call. Old person, the killer of runs, man. <laughs> Can't slow down. You think the gnolls are easier in this than no boss? Or are you talking about the uh, dryer? I don't fuck with this old person shit at all. Mm -mm. So the last one died. <laughs> On my way. Boy, these guys have a lot of health. Uh oh, ninety five percent miss feels bad. Oof. That could have been bad because we were prone and we just took almost half of our fucking health bar. Holy shit. Please don't miss. Wow. That was fucking brutal. I think I almost died there. <laughs> Thank you. 
the fuck? How did your runs die at the creche? <laughs> like they get. You fell a speech in the room before the general, and the second was the fight with the main. Yeah, I don't think we're ever gonna like try to assault the Kreesh. I I really just want to go there for the monk armor. No, we haven't. We haven't. We we're thinking about going to the mountain pass next, basically. for the vendor over there, because that vendor's fucking good. So the hag shouldn't be upset that I killed all of her gnomes? <laughs> uh, what confident are we feeling about this? You catch a wolf. An old hunter's trick. If you can't mask your scent, spoil it. Today, that is why you came to her lair, I take it. To bargain. A more in her kind know how to ask. And they'll share whatever but the thing I just want to leave. Thank you. Can I visit past the patrol? God, I want to fight him so bad. That's so much juicy XP just lying around there. Oh no, where's my potion vendor? Oh, there you are. Hi, Auntie. Hello. What do you say? Want me to take care of the little bugger? Thanks, Auntie. You're the best. Love you. You know, I think we could probably kill the ogre and the, the dude fucking the ogre. That'll help us a little bit with the XP. rattle the door. Then, a low moan. 
someone or something is having a bit of fun. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? No, we haven't gotten to Forge. I forget, we could do the boat fight. There's no good loot from the boat fight, right? I could just tavern brawler and yeet everyone off the boat. Call it a day. That's actually maybe the next play. Uh oh. Fuck, I really regret not getting that bow for initiative. Shit, I don't have key. I'm fucking stupid. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. I made a mistake. Uh... Yeah, we're just gonna fucking misty step right out of here. What path lies before me? One of the guys on the boat does has loot if you eat him. What kind of loot are we talking about on the boat? Is one of the boat dudes a vendor? That's a good question also. I'm glad we got that Misty Step necklace, guys. <laughs> Real glad. A hammer that I won't use? Okay, we can just eat them all then. Did I miss out on this now? I feel like I might have missed out on this. Nah, okay. That's a friendly looking shadow. Now, we do have a pair of boots that prevents us from getting moved, but it's medium armor. You think it's still worth taking an armor? Mm. Like, I don't want to get yeeted off the boat. That would for sure suck. Why don't I want to eat them? I do want to eat them. Things fucking chunky. Jesus Christ. What are these terrible rolls we're having? Why are we doing no damage to this fucking thing? Armor class reduced by two. Right, why? Why? What's up, Carrie? Yeah, we're gonna run. He's resistant to all physical damage. Gotcha. 
Into the bloody fray! <laughs> that works. Don't go back in the barn. Oh, it's not gonna be a very fast fight. I mean, I think I could survive a throw. I'm trying to position myself so it doesn't have an angle on it. Man, that resistance is fucking insane. Honestly, instead of this, I should just be throwing an alchemist fire. Get the burn proc. Oops. Mm. All right. Keep forgetting too how we get the Titan bow. Oh yeah, we gotta get the thieves in, which means we need to get the password from the Knowles. Cause that bow would have made this a lot faster. <laughs> Jar on the boat has a bow that you can use that does fear on hit. So there is good loot on the boat. Yeah, it wasn't a very quick fight, <laughs> but we're alive. <laughs> yeah, I, I forgot. You're right. The Titan string we can't use. There's a short bow from the boat fight. Then we have to loot. Do they get the surprise on me on the boat? Can I bypass it with a... Uh... Well, shit. If we use an elixir of vigilance, then we don't have the strength potion. How do I get the surprise on the boat? Because if we can get the surprise on the boat, I'm pretty sure I can just one shot drawer and, you know, fucking invis all over the boat. Oh, yeah, you're right. And do a dialogue check by throwing the dwarf off. And that gives me initiative. Hopefully, that's the dwarf that doesn't have the bow. Is that a strength check? That dialogue? Hmm. 
I don't really want to avoid fights if I can fight. It is a strength check. Okay. Welcome back. Have you made any new discoveries? Hey, magic missile. The boat fight is a run ender for sure. It doesn't have giant fingers, bro. I do enjoy a good bargain. If anything in my private collection is very well, I have mushroom. Magic missile necklace versus misty stuff. Man, I like having misty stuff in my pocket. So does the druid or does the jar that I throw drop the bow that we want? Cause I don't care about no fucking mace. He does? Ah shit. So we should just bypass the bow fight and then kill him later. Eh? I'm really liking my jump boots. <laughs> I don't know what your reverberation one's done, but jump boots are pretty solid. Huh. Well, yeah, the problem with the boat fight is if, if I get surprised or roll poorly on initiative, I could just get yeeted off. It's not really... Is there like a scroll or something? Is there a way for me to not get yeeted? <laughs> While you're concentrating. You can't be knocked prone or moved against your will. 19 to 14 armor class, though. We can use the bark skin potion. What do the reverberation boots do? Let's go look at them. Welcome back. Have you made any new discoveries? Let me see. Ah, oh, I greet you, son child. He don't got no boots. Oh. Hmm. When the wearer inflicts a condition upon a hoss suddenly they inflict two turns of reverberation. I don't know how to use that. Do our monk spells count? They do count as spells, right? Because those fi that fire glove attack we did. Was spell save DC in the, in the reading, right? Maybe we should wear this from now on.
The class actions, but don't they do spell rolls? Uh, how do we bypass the boat fight? Maybe we should go kill the drawer while we're here. How is your more personal That took the edge off. This will help with some of my spells. These ones, right? Is our movement speed feeling pretty good right now? Honestly. Oh, but this is for three turns, huh? Oh, it's only giving me 1.5 meters? That's pretty trash. Let's go buy this new helmet. With grace lately. I greet you, son child. Oh, wait, we need to save our money for the monk armor. Fuck. <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. I think that shit's expensive. One point five meters per stack, but isn't it only like one stack? So how do we approach this without getting ambushed? Hmm. Are they using invisibility? Do I have a scroll of detect invisibility? Does that counter this? Eh? Or are they stealthed? They're dry, right? So they're they're invisible. That's a class action. I could try to take out the reanimated one first, but I don't know where it is. Yeah, where's the necromancer? I don't have Volo's eye, do I? No. We should go get that, actually. About time. <laughs> that, that playthrough died. Uh, quite the cozy setup, you. It's not. Volo carefully holds one of the needle finds the gap between the needles. Oh, bother. Volo carefully withdraws the Volo slowly brought tap. Do you feel that? Ha! Huh. I stress. He pauses. There appears to be an amount of uh, though um, I'm terribly <laughs> He's so silly. <laughs> Necromancer is the one sitting on a wooden ledge under your level. He's the one that you have cost you for the dialogue. The nearest building to where I was? Yeah, we got a good eye. Can't risk being an open the Necromancer's field. in here? Oh, that guy drilled her eye out lower. Is my see invisibility gonna work? 
Because rather than pass a dialogue check, which we could fail, I'd rather go invisible myself, use my sea invisibility, and jump that guy. And say, fuck the dialogue check. But I don't know if I can actually see if these guys. We're not branded now. I fucked that up. <laughs> but if I can't detect them, I don't want to waste an invisibility potion. Once you walk close by, they'll have to keep passing stealth checks not to be seen. So I'm going to go down there. Invisibility potion. Keep going turn-based mode and keep skipping turns trying to see the guy. This should work. Spot for an ambush. Ah, this is cool. Holy fuck, this guy's level seven. No one said nothing about that. I know the one in the shed behind me. That's the obvious one. No, I don't do barrel mine seas, huh, too? For only the 50 millionth time I said it this playthrough. That's the Necromancer? The level 7 one? Fuck. Holy shit. Yeah, we can summon temp. We can summon. We're not allowed to bring like uh, hirelings or anything. Oh yes, counter spell. Is it gonna counter spell my fucking monk? Man, this does not seem like a good way to get the five guys. <laughs> he can counter spell me. They're too big to throw, too. Fuck. I'm worried I can't even kill this guy because that guy is going to counter spell my monk abilities. We need to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> That's what we need to do. <laughs> fuck this. <laughs> fuck that. <laughs> Even if we can pick up the corpses and stuff, that guy's just way too beefy, man. 
gotta be an easier way to level five than that. Sucks we waste an invisibility potion, but I do not think that engaging these guys is the play. I don't think there's any any situation where fighting a level seven as a level four is a good idea in honor mode, guys. Regardless of how much we can put the fight into our favor. <laughs> I don't <laughs> I don't think this is a good play. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wasting invisibility is better than a run restart. We can't go here, can we not use the boat? We're Elemental Monk. Does Elemental Monk get the... We don't need much XP. Man, that's so little. <laughs> we only need uh, we only need 84 XP, guys. <sighs> 74. I was just testing. <laughs> it even says there. <laughs> Fuck math. Could go kill some of the monsters, the hook hookers. How high level are the hookers? Uh, we're dark urge. I think it might be right. One might be by itself when we approach. Let's go see what a hook claw is looking like right now. Discover the fish people? I haven't done that. Ah! The problem with the fish people is the swarm, right? There's just so many of them. I would need like a fireball scroll. We do not have scrolls worth of shit right now because we don't have any AOE. We use it all for the grove fight. I've been checking for scrolls, but no one's had shit. Is the bullet gonna attack me here, guys? I'm a little bit worried about that. I want to draw any attention. I'm actually I'm so scared right now. <laughs> Did you kill the dwarf lady's husband? No, I didn't. You can get all the fish dudes XP through dialogue. That sounds 12 charisma. The bullets attack there. North next to the exploding mushroom cave. We could go try to save that dude. I know I'm running out of easy fights, which isn't a big deal. I just want to hit five before we have to do the hard fights, you know? I don't remember how to do the fish dude stuff. Sharp, deep, and still fresh. Some monster did this, marking its territory. We 
We did wizard tower, yeah. Like, I don't know how to do the fish beep thing. I, I don't know. I've never done. 97 health. I wonder how much rescuing this dude's worth. How does one even do this without blowing everyone up? The run is, is getting to the hard spots. What, what is the trick to this? Oh, Y'all are, are talking in gibberish. Do the BB bong quest with the instrument and the dagon. You guys sound like you are not even speaking the same language as me right now. Y'all y'all sound like you're ordering Korean food, okay? Mage hand. Strength check can work here. I mean I got misty step, but like I got miss I got misty step. I don't even need this scroll. I just, I just know what I'm doing. Bad idea. Just like go talk to him? Jump up on the left, then to his backpack. You can go turn base. Yeah, I mean, going turn base would be cool if I knew what the fuck I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> this seems sus. Why are you jumping all sorts of fucked ways? The high road. Wait, is there a, is there an alternate path? What? Oh, jump up here. Okay, this helps. Will I go there? Go there? That looks safe. Nice. Okay, I want to talk to this guy? Pick up the torch? That doesn't sound good. <laughs> Do I actually want to pick up the torch? Put out the fire on the torch. Take the whole bag. Did we almost die? Torch doesn't matter. <gasps> okay, well, I'm pretty sure the torch mattered and we would have been dead if we didn't pick it up, right? Pretty sure. Oh, he did. Just give him Misty Step, yeah. Hey there, buddy! What did you get some Misty Step here for? Are you gonna need to just cast the scroll on yourself? <laughs> oh, boy. Um... Torch don't matter if you don't mess up. Well, fortunately, we grabbed the torch because we did mess up. I think it saved our life. You had two skulls. I don't understand. Like, I'll just cast Misty Step on someone else. Yeah, that works. No, fuck, it doesn't. 
I have to give him a scroll. I don't know how to do that. He's dead. He's dead. Okay. He's dead. We're alive. It's fine. It's fine. Throw him the bag. Yeah, I don't know, like, give him... Just give him Misty Step. Like, what? Oh. Here's Misty Step, bro. Huh? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck you guys are talking about. I've only played the game one time, okay? I don't know everything and all of the stuff. You think I save people? You see what happened to the Grove? You think I go out of my way to save people? Fuck, I have no idea what I'm doing. That's why you guys are here to tell me to do the correct things. Which I did not do. Chat was telling you, uh, give Misty Step is not a thing that you can just do. Like, okay, let's go into my scroll and let's see. Give, give, give. Yeah, I don't see this give Misty Step option, you know? Y'all are not speaking Japanese. You know, maybe like use Misty Step on him, throw him Misty Step. You know, like don't just give. We got the we got the bibber bang, sure. Ah, don't worry about it. It's over. Uh, I mean we're fine now, right? A lot of scary sounds. Let's just go walk over here. What does that take me? That looks like fun. We can go grab that bark for XP, Head right? Ahead. Maybe. Pacor, is there multiple? Oh God, this is scary. Breathe quiet, move with care. I don't like being out here, guys. I'm, I'm gonna be real. I, I'm, I'm not enjoying this area. Nice Dark fucking Dark quest. Watching me. <laughs> I don't know. We should be in the Underdark. Everything's at like a hundred health and level seven and shit. And one shot in Mushroom Valley and. Burrowing thing that could kill us literally at any fucking moment. They're gonna leave. <laughs> I can shoot the green things now. Wait, there was a mushroom I should have grabbed? So, explode the mushrooms. Don't explode the mushrooms. Where is the mushroom? Is that on his body? Right hand side. Ah, I see, I see. I mean, as long as there's fire, I won't get one shot, right? As long as there's no fire, we're good.
How am I supposed to actually grab this thing without Mage Hand? Oh, by stopping time. Yeah, I'm trying to keep my key points if possible. We're running low on supplies. Alright, I'll go back to the Micronite colony and turn this in to someone. Talk to his wife or some shit. Who's the mushroom for? This guy? The nutrition my species receives from other Welcome back. Have you made any new discovery? You want mushrooms? I greet you, sun child. Well, he died, but I'm pretty sure that guy was useless anyway, so we're fine. Hopefully we get some XP here. <laughs> we just need 74 XP. Well? Gotta be some people I could Dead. kill. Worthless old fool. He had one bleeding job. Lo Balin losing his mind was the only good he ever did. Mike, I should have killed him myself. Kill it. Not no more, though. Uh, go on, then. Hand it over. Thanking you. Look, I, Balin, you take... Man, all we need to do is kill, like, a frog or something at this point. We just need to kill something random. Gotta be something I could kill. Gotta be some living creature in the game. <laughs> you know, I don't know if I actually killed the two goblins in the Blighted Village on the uh, edge. I think that I think that I probably did. They would be on the west side, right? Right there. It's gotta be something to murder. Killed the red caps in the swamp actually, we did. What were the gloves that I miss out? Uh what did they do? We did kill the red hooks, yeah. Oh! You sniffing as the symbol glows. Power course. This looks like it could be 20 XP. Nice! Hell yeah! We bought the ding! By my hand. What the fuck just happened there? Did this fall? <laughs> But they were gloves, and we got armor we got armor class gloves on, so I'm not sweating them too much. Nice. Well, I don't care about Auntie Ethel's basement either. I needed 20 XP, not 120 XP. I could give two shits now about 120 XP. Now we're gonna have to kill. We gonna kill some bosses, guys. I'm gonna do some adventurous shit. Wow. We 
haven't done the spider yet. Should we start off with the spider? No, we the only boss we've killed is with Mithander, if you count her. And uh the goblin boo-boo. What are those things called? The humanoid goblin. Man, I missed two 95% hits against level one goblins. Uh. Excuse me. Hop, are they called hop goblins? Bugbears, bugbears, yeah. I don't know why they're called bugbears. Oh, look at that juicy health increase, guys. A key point. Let's go. Free attack. But wait a second. Is this a free weapon attack? Because that's pretty bad. I need a free unarmed attack. Weapon or unarmed? Oh my goodness. Possibly stuns. What kind of role is the stun on? <laughs> Going to the hag's basement would aggro her? I mean, that would suck. Okay. We, we don't ever learn new monk spells, huh? It's kind of stupid. I'm thinking we can go kill Skeleton in the tower. Let's go check the percent chance of a successful throw. What the fuck is this guy? Wait, do I not have a waypoint for that? Huh? Just living waters this dark. <clears throat> Arcane Tower. Look at how happy our little gnome is. Can't even climb a window still. <laughs> Can other classes climb a window? <laughs> Let's take a look here. I'm not gonna throw them yet, I'm just gonna see. Too heavy to throw. Well, there goes that fucking plan.
Yeah, but if the push fails, which is very likely, we'll just lose. Well, Thunder is a constitution check. Hope you had fun, JJ. Do we think the Knoll fight's easier? I don't know. So what I'm thinking is Even these guys have 42 health. boss you think is easier? I mean, he can't detect invisibility, right? I'm thinking we could just knock out all the little guys, go invisible a bunch. I, I think the opposite approach. I don't I think we want to kill all the little dudes. You have flower on the little dudes won't atta even attack you. Well, I have one flower in the bank, and I'd rather just like kill them. One flower. I'll blur. And fuck up the little guys and hope to go invisible every time. We have advantage with these gloves, right? So we should fuck them up pretty easily. And then we feather fall and jump the fuck away when we run out of key points. We blur preemptively just in case shit hits the fan. We try completely unarmed. Well, if we have advantage, I don't think we need to, right? I don't think we're going to throw here, so we might as well throw in the lightning ring.
Oh, that's a good point, Rusty. Yeah, because then we'll get more lightning charges per turn, right? We'll Is that gonna be better than plus one bonus damage? Yeah, probably. Goes nothing. Some fellow whisper. I think we'll be all right. I did not get surprised. And that thing did not die. <laughs> this isn't going great. Uh, fuck. <laughs> I mean, everyone else is surprised. I'm sure we can take a hit from this dude, right? I don't think he can push me off, eh? Let me position just in case. Deep and move. Why did I not do as much damage as I thought? I think I'm in danger. <laughs> uh, okay, it's working. <laughs> it's working. A little scary. <laughs> yeah, I should have. I forgot I have an extra attack now. I should have done that, Gomer. Slight misplay. If everyone else minds their business, I'll be fine. Big boy just can't be surprised. That's that's like most bosses, right? It's just gonna be a consistent mechanic. That one a little bit better. Need to find a way forward. So why is he all like that right now? Because he used the static discharge. I feel like I could be playing this better. Just have a few. Alright, time to skulk about. Like, I sh 
What do I go about this? I don't understand exactly. He was like, so he's going to static discharge. And then afterwards, he's going to be susceptible to attack. Is, is that what's happening here? So I should try to get some punches on him when he was like hunched over like that. His legendary action is attacking things that attack him, though. The first foe that attacks at each round. Breathe deep and move. Swift as my feet can carry me. Better be cautious. Uh, maybe we just keep doing this. I feel like I feel like this is good. It's going good, Fry Lord. Going very good. We are We are finding bosses. <laughs> Time to press ahead. Yeah, pretty nice. I know, Rusty. So, do I want to make an attack soon here? Let me look at what happens with. I don't need any attention right now. Better than nothing. I mean, it says at the very first foe that attacks each round, he can fire leaping strikes. But it also says he can't do shit. <laughs> so, like, what is, what is actually going to happen if I attack him? <laughs> Which one of these is, <laughs> is like, I mean, I feel like the, I feel like the legendary action trumps his stunned, right? We are to have Umbrella, yep. We did some stealth today, too, actually. Well, for, for the Harpy fight. I think the legendary action is going to always work. Well, there's no way we bypass the legendary action. Right? Someone scratch to bait the legendary action. No. Well, there's an idea, but it's going to eat my action while this guy is incapacitated. That's what I'm thinking too, Rusty. I feel like we, we need to attack now. <laughs> How many enemies are there still? It's just the one guy. Just the one, huh? <sighs> Our buffs have worn off too at this point. You've made a great mistake. 
didn't say that. That didn't do much. Shouldn't have made me your enemy. Damn, he's fucking beefy as hell. <laughs> Uh, holy shit. Keep doing it. That's only four damage. My God, he is a tanky son of a bitch. <laughs> Holy fuck. Yeah, I should have hurt flurried more. I noticed that the last one, which is why I did flurry at the end. You're right, there is one down there. Fuck. We don't have enough key now. Shit. Walking death. Oh, well, it's gonna get a little interesting here, guys. Very well. Good old stealth mechanics. This calls for careful. Gotta love those. They should all be running. Classic. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Thought we had a strategy going. Is it because he was stunned he was taking so little damage? Or that's just it is how it is? Just resistances. Fuck. Okay, well, like, the real issue is how do we stay in combat? <laughs> this is so derpy. A 
Okay. So he gets stunned after he does his discharge. Right? So we start combat when he's not stunned. We run around and do a bunch of crazy monk jump maneuvers. Wait for him to get stunned. Then he'll be in combat already. Right? We just punch him when he's stunned and just keep kiting him around. What's up, second lot? Does that sound like I know I'm chat well I'm I'm keeping the little guys alive right now because I'm trying to brainstorm the fight and it seems like the best way is to kill them all. Because we're not like my ideas seem to make a lot of sense and be optimal. Go beat up little dudes, proc invisibility, go hit him when he's stunned, go beat up little dudes when he's not stunned, but the game's like, ah, ha, ha, fuck you. <laughs> you, th you think you're smart? Well, we're just gonna heal him fully. <laughs> Cause I mean, we're on some galaxy brain shit that should be working well, but we're not able to have him maintain combat. <laughs> Which is fucking stupid. <sighs> Need a safety break, so now. Whoa, 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 I didn't tell you to do that. I didn't tell you to do that! Oh, it's not even that it was cheese. That would be, like, the clever way to fight. <laughs> the way we're gonna have to approach it is just kiting them around in patience. Which is, honestly, way less... cool. <laughs> Um, also, I'm pretty sure there was two guys alive. Oh, yeah, he's right. Right. Yeah, exactly what you guys are saying. Because the fucking out of combat bullshit. Kind of lame. So the optimal way to do damage now that we have double bare fists would be to fangs of the fire snake, and then do flurry of the blows twice. Right? Is that is that the way to do this now? No, I still can't, so black. I'm not getting Flurry of the Blows as an option, as a bonus action, right? With haste. I'm mean, gonna burn through key fast, but we're not dying. <laughs> so. I'm okay with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't use it as an extra attack, so I didn't mess up. Fucking elevator camper. Am I not gonna get a bonus action, though? Oh, it doesn't seem to matter.
can't I exit turn-based mode? I'm, I'm confused. Are we in combat? Are we not in combat? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> uh, I'm confused as shit. Light on my feet. It's gonna go up here safe. Well, see, now we maintain combat. Never mind. <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> okay. If everyone else minds their business, I'll be fine. They use the shield of thralls. That's a good idea. In fact, we're gonna cast some buffs here. Being an open view. I feel like blur is pretty solid, right? could use this and then we gain bonus lightning defense but i'm not sure if the majority of his damage is physical or lightning i don't think mage armor is good because we're at 17. we are wearing a lightning resistant ring can that not stack they don't stack. So we do a little blur. Let me do a little bit of shield of thralls. Better be cautious. Alright, here we go. Yeah, I think the reason mage armor is bad for monks is because it actually counts as armor, right? Strangely. Should mind my step. What sucks about this is I, I have absolutely no way not to take his legendary action. You know? Some in the imp. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that's a good idea. I right, shovel. <laughs> Time to do your thing. 35% chance. I hope this triggers the legendary action. <laughs> Jeez. 
sure didn't. <laughs> Rip shovel. <laughs> well. <sighs> <laughs> Maybe he did do a legendary action. I don't know. I don't know if he did or didn't. I have no idea. Do we just disengage and kite? Or do we attack? No, he got initiative advantage and just killed it. I think we'll shocking touch him and see how hardcore this initiative action is. Why am I only getting a 64% chance to hit? Hold on. Oof. What? Oh, that didn't seem bad. That didn't seem bad at all, eh? And I failed it? Oh. What's up, Irby? That's not bad at all, then. I guess my lightning resistance ring is really caring. Did we not get an extra attack? No, we didn't. Unless it's because... No, we did not. Alright, let's punch in... Mm -hmm. We kind of need to dash, don't we? Fuck. Mm, maybe jumping is fine. Trying to save some key, you know. Absolutely. Jump boots, OP. Uh. I thought I was immune to electrocution. <laughs> How come I just took three damage? It's not electrocuting, okay. So we take a lot of damage if we're gonna attack him right now, is what I'm reading here. So let's just kite. <laughs> I think we can just disengage and jump, right? Save our key, because we're going to need to put damage on him once the stun is off. I only get one jump, though. Oh, I can jump over the other roof. Let's go. <laughs> Frog shit. I don't want to get too much space from him here, actually, right? Because I don't know if he's going to move or he's going to get stunned right there. I guess we'll just see for science. 
Okay, he moved. Now get stunned. One more turn, I guess. Hopefully that lightning shit doesn't have vertical damage. Okay, it looks like it does. That's fine. Okay, so I'll have to remember he immediately gets stunned, okay? <sighs> After it wears off, he can't move. A little bit of learning here, okay? Honestly, I think we shouldn't attack right now because I'm going to lose the benefit of the one to four fire damage on my melee attacks, right? I mean, we can just do like pew pew. It would be nice to get some acid on the ground, eh? Or will this not put acid on the ground? So if we can reduce his armor count, that would be really nice, right? Will this put acid on the ground? It doesn't say it. It does, okay. Nice crit. The acid didn't go on him, though. I guess he's got to step into it. <laughs> How can you miss that? Now, if I shoot him, he's going to... Uh, leaping static sounds like it is not melee. We're just going to get comfy. No, I don't want to turn the ground into fire. I actually want him to... Finish a round in the acid so that his armor class is reduced. Oh, shit. Why did he get stunned there? We don't want to melee him with this discharge up. But he's stunned, so he shouldn't be able to use his legendary action. <laughs> I'm trying to use the luck of the far realms on like a big melee hit. Oh, yeah, you're right. I should throw instead. Why do I even use the bow? You're totally right. I forget we're tavern brawler. <laughs> we should be using the advantages of our class. <laughs> That's a good call, dude. Do we have anything to throw, though? No, I sold all of our weapons. <laughs> Will throwing some random shit at him do more damage than an arrow? Take a hammer, bitch. <laughs> but, okay, he wasn't stunned. Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're stunned again now? Yes. I got another hammer. <laughs> 
Here, take this goblin bow, bitch. It's not, it's not optimal damage. Hey, I got a sword. That's got to do more than two. <laughs> oh my fucking God, this is silly. Water than ice? I don't think I have any of that shit. <sighs> so I think this turn he will be still. Right? He's got one static overdrive left. Man, I'm so confused about turns and shit. Can move another turn or can move another turn? I have fucking no idea. This is confusing me. Let's not take any risks. I'm not gonna go quite as far though. Ah, fuck. Really didn't mean to stand in my own acid. Okay, phew. Okay, yeah, it did, it did wear off there. Should have went with my gut. Only stunned for one turn, though. <sighs> I can't go up there. Just, fucking... Just have to... Remember, the stun's better. Okay, so this is turn one. Now he still has two more turns. So this is one. Am I getting this mixed up? It's so not intuitive. Fuck. If I'm counting it right, like... Attack him. We can't attack him right now. That's the worst thing we could do. Hoping I counted this right. No, I didn't. What the fuck? So confusing. All right, I'll just remember to do one, be one more turn aggressive than I think I am. <laughs> so confusing. Uh, I've been staring at his buffs and it keeps being one turn less than I think it is. 
That's fine, I can work with that. I'll just do one turn less than I think. Next time we'll punish him pretty good. Climb up here and we will not move this time. Easy. So now we stay. I think the reason why I'm getting confused is because his turn is first. And it procs at the start of his turn. Does that make sense? Not at the end? I don't know. I don't know if I'm explaining that correctly. Another day, another fight. I should have done that on the flurry. It's okay. Some solid damage. Oh, I can't jump. Whoopsies. Because <laughs> I used my bonus action. All right, well, hopefully we can survive because I fucked that up. <laughs> Let's hope we don't die here. Okay, perfect. Clean. I'm getting the hang of it. Not maybe the most intuitive mechanics, but it works. So don't use my bonus action this time. We're just gonna play it safe. We haven't got hit by him yet. And I don't really wanna get hit by him. <laughs> you know? I don't We can get hit by this. This ain't a big deal. Nice. All right. That was a weird fight. <laughs> well, we got him. <laughs> yeah, getting hit by him at the very last round seems like a terrible, terrible, terrible plan. <laughs> like the worst thing possible. <laughs> Why send it and eat a hit? Possibly. <laughs> Sounds absolutely horrible. Got him though. How much XP? Good question. <laughs> that much. <laughs> so little. <laughs> what the fuck? How is that so little XP? <laughs> uh, 
fucking hell. Terrible XP. You get XP if we dialogued him? We did get XP earlier when we dialogued him and got the ring and whatnot. Alright, well, one boss down, though. Okay. Um. Time to get going. What next? Hyena? Hag? We're gonna need a like real proper hag strat. I mean, we could discuss that while I go try to fuck with the hyena. Or the gnolls, yeah. I know, hag is so tough on solo, specific. Honestly, maybe we should start looking for magic missile scrolls. Mini target arrows for Hag. Do you know where I get them? That's a good idea. Welcome back. Especially, well, she's Faye. She's not a monstrosity. That could help for the Hag. Man, this could help against the gnolls. Oh, that's a good point, Troopa. Let me see. Don't think about that. Ah, Blurg. I greet you, son child. When you do scrolls, is this affected by scrolls too? Is maybe they want this for the hag fight, huh? I have in 44 Alley. I get Steve-O a lot. I mean, we gotta fight the Hag sooner or later. Oh shit, where did we get the Beholder from, by the way? I don't know why I'm forgetting this. Spider Pit? Some shit? Maybe we should go start with spider. Is that the easiest boss first? Spider or gnolls? I'm gonna buy this. I think this is better than what we have. You think on legendary spider is harder than hack? Cause all the ads. Grace lately. Yes, she is cataloging Koroto and fertility rituals. Oh, well, perhaps after I finish. Spider's pretty bad because all the ads are. Mm. Yeah, and we're a monk, so we don't really have like. <laughs> Multi hit. Well, we actually maybe that'll be a big win for sweeping cinders strike. Spider is vulnerable to damage. <laughs> well, that's surprising. Um, okay. Welcome back. I do enjoy a good bargain. If anything in my private collection <laughs> is to your liking. Vulnerable to damage.
I need to start making quotes for things chat says. That would be a good one to throw on there. Very well. I have mushrooms to catalog. Oh wait, what's up with the Sylvanas buff? Is that not something I should have sold? I gotta buy it back. back. While well, I'm here. Any new discoveries? What's a fucking Sylvanas buff? Oh my god, it's a thousand dollars now! Oh, rip Sylvanas buff. Hope it's not good. Uh, let's go see if this lady has scrolls or anything. I could have traded that statue for a ring? What? No point in lingering now I've got the noble stock. Man, you got all sorts of shit. Oh, I sold you all this shit. Wait, where do I get that ring? That sounds really good. Armor class ring? I want that. Can I get something I can get now? That would be like, hmm. That'd be great. Mole? Who's mole? Some sort of rat person? Probably someone dead already, eh? Oh, they've probably been dead forever ago. Have I got everything then? Yeah. <laughs> nah, they left. I'll remember that next time. Damn, that sucks. One armored class sounds fucking awesome. Not nutrition my species receives from other minds is difficult to emulate. <laughs> That, yeah, if they left for Act 2, then rip ring. Oh, you basically had to steal it earlier anyways. Alright, we're gonna make the smart decision and try to sneak past. Is this where I'm trying to go to get to the good thinking? Sheesh. Am I doing it? We will not fail, Blackith. I expect you to fall on your sword if you do. Can we just do that? I only got one invisibility potion left. I'm gonna jump so fucking far. Oh shit, maybe we could just Misty step all the way over there. I'm gone, bitch. <laughs> Let's go. Easy bonus action.
Oh fuck, one doesn't just get this cloak. This is this is the crazy hard part. And there's some stupid skeletons. Is it after the warp point or before? It's before, isn't it? Only if I go left. I will absolutely not go left. Go left from the warp point? Okay. Psych. No way does the wizard drop a thousand XP. No fucking way. That old man? I can beat up that old man for a thousand XP? I will kick that old man's ass so fucking hard. Ah. A friend. You know, I've had nothing. Look over there. Do you see that wretched little... Oh, they have the audacity. Honestly, I was doing them a favor of... The s hogwash, of course. Uh, I beg your pardon. <laughs> Look, <laughs> I need an air force. <laughs> oh, that bring was me funny. an egg. <laughs> there was some weird dialogue happening there. Oh, you wonder. Oh, <laughs> it looks different to what I expected. <clears throat> Are you sure that's a gith egg? I didn't know you could do this. Man, we can't roll shit. Are these hard rolls to, to roll? I mean, I don't think it matters, right? <laughs> Wait, this one's so funny. Everyone needs a hobby, I suppose. But if you find a gith egg, do return it. No matter how much you like it. That was the best dialogue I've seen in the game so far. That shit was fucking what funny. News of our little project. I just like Have it. You found the egg? Very well. But I'll make note of how much time you waste trawling through baubles. Oh yeah, that we need that. Oh my god, why does it cost three thousand dollars? Oh my god. Is it guaranteed if I kill her that shit drops? Cause she's fucking dead. Oh yeah, isn't there a way to get all of it when she's sleeping or something? Man, we need this too. She's got a lot of stuff we want, guys. Well, I don't know exactly how killing people relates to the items they drop. That That's the issue. You know? What if we pickpocket her and she just runs off and disappears forever and we get nothing? Is she going to end your run if she goes first after stealing? Oh, I mean, she's going to, like, kill me. What you're saying. Is 
She can fuck you up. Can we knock her out? And then take everything. Yeah, we fucked up that statue shit, man. Way long ago. It sounds really sketch in general to get that ring, so I'm not, I'm not that upset by it. Happy, are we? Now, can I click pickpocket on her without her getting mad? It's only on a fail to steal something, right? Yeah, it's not looking very good. <laughs> I mean, certainly we could boost that a little bit, but like... Mm. I think I actually do have a feigned death scroll. I was looking at him like, what the fuck is the purpose of this ever? Maybe I sold it. Yeah, I think I sold it because I was like, why the fuck would you ever use this? Man, even if we could boost it, I'd rather get the jump on her and kill her and just cross our fingers that she drops the shit we want. Eh? Is that... I don't think the skeletons can fall on it. Maybe they can. I think we're just gonna punch the shit out of her, guys. Well, the chess piece is kind of game breaking. The chess piece is like incredibly good for us. I mean, I guess it's four decks, right? If we get that chess piece, can we drop all of our decks? I can't remember, because it's like, we were talking about it a little bit last time. Something, something, virtual decks, something, something, regular decks, blah, blah, blah. I think it is one of those things that sets our decks. No, it doesn't. Oh, it gives two up to a max of 20. Is that what it said? Let's kill her. Alright, kill her and cross her fingers. I will do all of the buffs.
All right. We got her surprised. She's dead. She is so fucking dead. Did I almost die? <laughs> Wait, how? How did, how did she bypass the surprise? She was like, oh, I'm surprised. I'm just going to sneak in this haste cast real quick. How did that happen? You can't just decide to haste when you're surprised. The fire shield actually got the kill. I'm very happy. <laughs> that we casted that buff. Yeah, how was she able to haste herself when she was surprised? My first turn was her surprise round. These mechanics need to get a little bit more consistent. All right, cool. Well, we don't get the armored gloves, but that's fine. I was planning on stacking the armor with the graceful cloth. That's the important thing for me. Because I think our armor level is going to be a little bit better there. Is it because she won initiative? Okay. Okay, that makes sense. She won initiative, so her surprise... I don't know, you think it wouldn't be on her character slider then, though? Ugh, I don't understand. Alright, let's see here. It didn't give me one single armor? What? Oh, because this thing gives me an armor class. So it gives me one, but it comes out even. Doing more damage is nice, though, yeah. And we get jump distance as well. Okay. I'm okay with that. So now we don't even need to go here anymore. Got what we wanted. Hyena time. She dropped the staff and we don't use staffs anymore. It's it's gotten to the point where it's better to just punch. Well wait, is that true or not though? Now that we're not hmm. What do I think about I have to figure this out. Okay. So we were punching because we were building lightning strikes and getting advantage against the constructs with these gloves, right? Now that we're not using the gloves, I think we want to use the staff again. Well, the thing is, we aren't using the staff attack, okay? We're using the staff to buff these attacks, okay? And then we're using bonus action unarmed attack and flurry of blows. 
The only time I'm main attacking is in some scrub ass bullshit mob, okay? Yeah, I know what lightning charges do. I don't want them. Yeah, I understand what you guys are saying, but we have we don't need to do a staff attack with our staff equipped. These are actions as well, and they're unarmed. As long as I'm not running out of key. Thank you guys for the follows. Yeah, I refresh the stream every once in a while. Sometimes that helps with delay. Unless I'm missing something. Because I believe using this staff and not using using just unarmed attacks and my key attacks is going to help the burst damage the most. If I'm in a more long drawn drawn out fight, then yeah, it's maybe better to use no staff, right? Because if I'm factoring it, I'm going to have to be doing unarmed attacks. But I think for burst, this is better. Like, if I have key points and I can use them, then the staff is better. Is that the best way to say this? Yeah. Because for the invisibility thing happening right now and using my the combo of Fang of the Fire Snake to Flurry of Bows is doing more damage with the staff, which is what's allowing us to kill secure things and turn invisible. Also, the staff has some sort of defensive thing on it, too, that I don't even understand, but it sounds like it's good. <laughs> it sounds good to me. Or something saving throws. God, there is so many of them. Holy shit. I don't need any attention right now. Jesus Christ. Trying to kill all bosses. Just out of view. <laughs> oh boy, this is crazy. Nah, Fupa, we need a hag strike for anything. They're grouped up really nice for AoE is what I'm thinking at the moment. Make sure I got the right gear on. I don't think we can throw these guys. Uh, Mm. 
Noel. These are humanoid. That's surprising. Man, I just have shit for AoE. Fuck. Oh, God. Great, I patched a stealth check, which means now everything's gonna be all fucked up. <laughs> God damn stealth bullshit. Okay, that time stealth worked. God, maybe, kind of, okay, whatever. Uh, I punch you. <laughs> I don't understand the mechanics of the style thing. <laughs> oh, here we go again. Uh oh. Okay. Well, we didn't get a sneak attack. Well, we didn't lose initiative, so that's okay. Don't waste a step. Oh, if they're gonna come out of here one time, they're gonna fuck up. I can deal with that. Why am I not getting sneak attacks? Maybe I wasn't sneaking that time. Oh god. That's fine. As long as the one nearest as long as the one that I didn't attack. We're good. I think we gotta punch him. That's how we do it. So like now I'm in a man hand attack, but it's fine because I should get initiative. I should get surprise here and I should be able to do unarmed attack. Might be optimal to start combat with flurry so you can get both of your regular attack actions. Let's see if that works. Let's test that. Okay, let's not test it on him. Let's test it on the hyena. Uh-oh. Why am I not getting sneak attacks? Thank God we're stealthed. Oh, scary. Oh, God, stealth is so sketch. I'm gonna... <laughs> Light on my feet. Would that have worked that way, right? Maybe? I have no idea. Ah, we took some of them out. Are they immune to surprise? Yeah. I think it's because I'm killing them. Surprise! Surprise won't trigger if you kill the thing you're attacking. 
need to hit it but not kill it. Oh, it's so weird. It's so weird because what's optimal in this game is never what like seems optimal. <laughs> I think I think what Troy is saying is right. Is that I don't want to kill someone. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure the invincibility cloak there saved our life. Because, yeah, we didn't get surprise. We killed it. But I guess that works. Ah, right on to be right. I want to draw it is, in fact, rocket surgery. So what I'd like to do here is pick off some of the smaller nulls and then get like a concentration scroll going to help for the actual boss. I don't have a glyph. I was trying to find an AOE. Don't have any. I have a single fucking AOE spell, except for like chromatic orb, if you even call that AOE. That was close. I think this is a... I'm sneaking, okay? I'm gonna start flurry, which means I should get a surprise and then I get two bonus moves. Hope your soul is in good hands. What could go wrong? <laughs> he died again. <laughs> but this time they're surprised. Nothing makes fucking sense. <laughs> oh my god. Now I can only go invisible once per turn. But I think we would get bonus action, right? So flurry opening with flurry is optimal. Because then I have a main attack and get a bonus action. I can't test because I need to get the fuck out of here. Wonder if the gods are watching me. <laughs> it's just vibes, right? Whatever happens, it's just vibes. <laughs> you just roll with it. It takes some sort of degree to understand the surprise and stealth mechanics in this game, and I, I don't possibly hope to comprehend that. Nah, yeah, that's why I didn't go for the hyena kill. It's weird, though, because I should have had two turns of invisibility. Maybe I would have got to read back. I think I would have. <laughs> May the gods take you first. <laughs> So see what I mean when I'm saying I'm using the main hand weapon? The staff sometimes on like trash mobs. But it shouldn't make a difference in those situations.
Man, we are just fucking wrecking with that. <laughs> That's such a ridiculous amount of fucking damage. The flurry, uh, the sneak attack flurry is fucking ruthless. So, I only have one point of invisibility. So what's happening is... I, I have no fucking idea. It's forcing a churn change. I should have two points of invisibility right now, so I'm exchanging. It's giving me surprise. You get out of combat, she'll heal. When is she gonna heal? <laughs> it's 110 out of 110. <laughs> now we can kill her. Hopefully. Breathe quiet. Move with care. That took the edge off. We need all of our key. We do have some hold person scrolls. But I'd rather just get the sneak attack in than, you know, 45% roll. And I think we do lead, we do lead with flurry. Very close. <laughs> Damn it. It's getting a little crazy. Good. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Let's see if we get the bonus hit now. We do get the bonus hit. Let's finish her off. There's an illicit parasite in that corpse. You should take a look. Well, we hitless that whole boss, so that's pretty solid. <laughs> hitless that whole ass <laughs> encounter. I forget, do I not want to look in this? Do we care? Something about... 
Now I'll just do that to the hag. The problem is we can't really sneak up on the hag. Oh, this is the spectator, so I definitely want to open that chest. No, I don't think the dryer fight will be easy on this because they're level 7. You don't want to look at it? Why not? I want that beholder for the hag. Maybe. Wait, the beholder attacks everyone. Maybe that, that was our beholder strat previously. If you want access to the merchant hideout, why the fuck would I want that? I think I'd rather have a beholder. Can't use the bow. Uh, longbow, monk shit. Short bow. Trying to think how strong the beholder is. What if we summoned the beholder and then invisibility potion during the hag? Beholder gonna get wrecked still? Is that a good Beholder has the invisibility. I want a beholder. It sounds fun. Come on, open up. Holy shit. Behold this. Chests like that don't have trinkets. There must be something valuable inside. All enemies have a sense presence spell. Well, no enemies been defeating us yet with it. Fuck those traps in that tunnel. That sounds sketchy. Isn't a spectator and beholder the same thing? They're basically the same thing. It's interchangeable. Speaking of, we do have a beholder boss or a spectator. As far as overworld bosses go, right? In the sunny place, it's the hag and that's it. Just the hag? Well, spider's under dark. Frank. As far as the overlight goes. Yeah, Poop Sage, I, I know exactly what you're talking about. But we're talking about if the beholder has this, this detect invisibility, and he might. I think about specifically the beholder type enemy. So, there is a spider boss in the well in the Blighted Village. Wait, are there two spider bosses? Or I'm just thinking of the same one. I just think it's in the Underdark. The Gethenki are still alive, and they sound scary. 
Sounds like a maybe we should avoid it kind of scenario. It's underground, not in the dark, okay. I don't even know if they're still over here, to be honest. Oops. XP is not anything to worry about for a while. We gotta kill some bosses. Did they just leave now? That I went to Act 2? Oh, we're not gaining another level for a long time. It's not even on my radar. Oh, they're still here. Wait, is it just one of them now? What's going on? Oh my god, this dragon looks sketch. We're not going to fight them. <laughs> I think we just stay away. <laughs> that looks like an L. Hmm. A dragon's hard to kill. What had 500x uh, HP? Spider or hag? Spider, Hag, Draugr, Lava, Construct, Boss. We need AoE for the Spider and the Draugr. Or multi-target stuff. We need strats, guys. We need strats. Carlac's fine. She's on the farm. Great farm in the sky. Did you already fight True Soul near? I don't know. some fucking bullshit. Never mind, we could jump over encumbered. Let's go. <sighs> Buy more potions from the hag first, too. That's not a bad idea. Can we just stealth up to the spider and then absolute... Well, there's a bunch of spiders. Fuck. I teleport all over the fucking place. Welcome back. Have you made any new discoveries? I kind of want to go for Hag for the, uh, the stat point. Isn't that crazy? Because, like, the stat point helps us the rest of the fights, right?
So we need to figure out what we're gonna do for the hag. Solo honor mode. So we can do with the stat point. I mean, we can respec accordingly. Isn't there a feat that lets us take two stat points? Yeah, we want to get the hag hair. Like, real bad. That could help for the hag. Yeah, we're not gonna cheese. <gasps> Fireball. Stealth and poison resistance to get to hag without a fight or lost health. I mean, I think we got poison resistance potions. True, does killing the clones give us invisibility with our cloak? That would be huge. Elixir of poison resistance. I mean, literally, can't we just jump over all that shit with a feather fall? <laughs> all of the clones can cast old person. Well, is right. I should get a mask. Now, if I'm in a silence field, I can't be held, though, right? What if we respect Shadow Monk? They accomplish. Use a Peerless Focus potion. Does the old strategy of popping in and out of darkness work? Properly. 
Now, the hag's melee hits are what do the damage, right? So, I think darkness would be better than silence, right? So, we throw darkness down. Respect to constitution saving throws. Because darkness is concentration, right? Perhaps Amelium is right. I should get a mask. But then we lose the damage of the tavern brawler. We have zero scroll. We have one magic missile. <laughs> We have no darkness scrolls. Uh, oh my god. Welcome back. Have you made any new discoveries? Jesus Christ, it sounds so scary. Let me. Oh, I greet you, son child. Have you spoken with Scris lately? Arrows of darkness will only cost you one attack of your two versus casting the spell from the scroll costs. It's pretty big, actually. It only lasts three turns. That's not a bad idea. Because then we can still attack and we don't have to worry about concentration breaking, right? It'll take a while for us all to rec Of course. I kind of like that idea. May you keep balance. Can we get a cloud giant potion? Because that's like a better version of the giant strength one, right? Can we enter the creature without a fight? I know, that's a good question. I got to roll an 18. I got to roll an 18. That sounds fucked. Yeah, so YouTube saying that it's only available on level seven. 
Brick Cloud Giant. So I'm thinking we I mean, we could try getting... I don't even know how to get in this stupid place. I kind of just want to go fight the hag. Isn't it a bunch of bullshit that I have to do, like, puzzles to get inside this fucking trash place? That's enough. Silence! No. <laughs> Anyone as I thought. Within the artifact, a feeling stirs. Uncertainty. Your curiosity is getting the better Were of they you. killing gnomes? No. Do not let it. Do they hate gnomes? Stay is that going to make it even harder for us to get in? They're hunting you. <gasps> they want the artifact. Racism They'll against gnomes. They'll from you. No poggies, no poggies. We don't have to save the girl to get the hair thing, do we? No reason to uh, save the girl during the gnome fight or the hag fight. Correct. I'm about to just send this shit. to take care of the little bugger what happens if i just punch you right now can i just like beat her ass here what's the best way to start the fight we killed them dwarves already unless more come potions first that's a good idea here for whatever you need Want me to take care of the little bugger? Keep your... I don't like busybodies. That is just attack her, huh? Ta-ta, Petal. Come see Auntie Sue. You can't get the, the hair if you fight her up here. How do I get her to go down there? <laughs> you can kill her and miss the hair. Yeah, we don't want to miss the hair. I want to just go fight her downstairs, but I don't know how to trigger it. Hello, sweetness. What do just you walk say? into the fireplace? Want okay. Me to take care of the little ah! 
That sounds easy. Behind it, I'm fucking scared. <laughs> I'm really fucking scared. You are as thick as that. This is my personal playhouse, and has that regular eaten you? You'll go nicely with me. Oh Lord, oh Lord. Wait, wait. What is this place? Don't look. Don't. Oh, I forget there's a fight before the hag, too, isn't there? Thank you, you Fawn. Crushing waves of fear as the presence within the door recoils. Can't Sneak to unlock to the mushroom teleport together. first in case you need a bail. I don't know what you're saying. Scene of weapons screen. You let them in. The door its form flickers, and you realize that the door is transparent. The door shudders. Imagining its wooden frame crack you see that with a jerk you You're saying you can actually bail from the hag fight if it gets crazy. I didn't know that You feel the barest hint of life from you see with a jerk you You feel the barest hint of life from within the door. Oh, I'm dumb <laughs> I can't remember, has this fight got some weird memes that's difficult to deal with? I feel like... Something, some mechanic or something. Anything that looks like a wizard's got to die first. Have to keep going. Break their pretty little bones. You see what happened to your friends? I doubt. I doubt you very much that you will break my bones. <laughs> Take your turn already. You're dead. You just don't know it. Might as well just fucking die.
And then on my turn, oh. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, makes sense. Oh, I can't long rest down there. Ah, oh, shit, I can't long rest in here either. Did I use something? I feel like I used that crit, right? Luck of the Far Realms. I think we went to long rest real quick, right? Can't remember if that's short or long. You're about to start your very first playthrough? Oh shit, dude. Good luck, man. Don't pick stealth. I don't know about getting to the mushroom teleporter room. I'm just gonna go down there and fight her. It sounds... I don't want stealth, man. If you tell me stealth, that means I'm gonna die. Too scared of stealth, guys. <laughs> Maybe this is a fight where we don't want to use the staff. That's what YouTube's saying. Sorry, I'm calling you YouTube. But Twitch people will understand more. Yeah, I think more hit chance is probably better without the staff. I think that's a good call. Distance. Armor class. Is Clara dead? I don't know who Clara is. Probably. Not a lot of things alive in Act 1 right now. <laughs> Not a lot. Did Dwarf Girl die? Uh, which one? Most likely. It's role playing. We're Dark Urge, okay? It's just role play. Oh, the when we were character. Like our build, yes. Every build has died except for this build. So, oh man, this is way bigger than I thought it was going to be. Jump over here, maybe? Maybe not. Fuck if I know what to do here. Can we, yeah, can I just fly over this shit? It's 
still going poison if I'm not careful. Do I not have a feather fall po thing? Remind me, we gotta swap boots, okay? Well, can I swap boots right now? Hopefully this doesn't remove it. Okay, we're good. That's fine. I don't want to get too close to the hag fight, right? So something like right there should be okay. Okie dokie. <sighs> Auntie Athel has eight initiative alert. Is she gonna go first? Is that what you're saying? I don't really know what you're saying. It sounds like she's gonna go first. Leave me here. Oh, hug the room before here to get to the mushroom, right? No, hug the wall here. Summon Scratch? I'm worried if I summon Scratch and send him in. Scratch is going to get in combat with the hag before I'm in combat with the hag, and she's going to get a bunch of summons out auto automatically. So basically, she's going to go first. First turn, she usually sets the cage on fire. Where should I try to go for the fight? Should we? It sucks because we're melee, you know? It's like, since we're melee, we have to be somehow getting to the hag. Now, she is fey, correct? So we should at least try to concentrate on protection of good and evil. I'm just gonna okay. run on in here. Okay. Fuck it. <laughs> Seems like there's not a lot of ways to prepare for this you fight because you need to adapt during home. it a lot, you know? Interfere in my business and now have the goal to face me in the Kind of depends what hair. happens. You petulant bollocks! I'll rip your spine out your ass or I'll use I'll and just out! Oh shit, wait, she has a legendary action. I forgot. This is a thing. Thank you, Fonin. I am surprised. That does not sound good. I didn't know I was gonna get surprised. Uh oh. 
Well, in your mountain of gibberish, the black, you didn't say I was gonna get surprised? Instead, I gotta decipher the fucking Da Vinci's code? Shit. Is that because I rolled bad or is that a mechanic? Shouldn't roll bad, I got fucking 18 decks. The hell is that crap? Uh oh. So much for gnome cunning. So much for gnome cunning. Please roll the save. Please roll the save. Please roll the save. Oh God, we're gonna die turn one. Then I'm held, GG boys. It was a good run. Did you reveal her first? How the fuck do I do that? Oh, that's it boys. That was a good, good run. Good fucking run. Old person kills us two runs in a row. Two runs in a fucking row, guys. <sighs> I didn't even get a turn, man. I didn't even get a fucking a turn. Man, not I I had what 16 wisdom and a gnome cunning. Well, fuck. I'm gonna try it again to see if she surprises me again if I rolled bad. I don't like what the best opener is for the fight. I should have snuck around the right hand side for my eyeball to do some shit. Let's see if that would have worked. So, why didn't I get surprised that time? Was that my eye seeing her? So that's consistent? Could have just done that? Fuck. Let's get this over with.
Man, imagine if we had haste up for a speed potion. Could have had that. The girl so bad. Boy. Fuck. Well, that should get rid of one of the clones. Interesting. This one, it's legendary action is second. You see that? That one is first. That one is first. That one is first. That one is first. So that's the hag right there. That's my guess. I like let me you want to be stronger just it's your choice sweetness a wild here uh -huh. deals on girl and you're the ballot bye bye damn <laughs> damn it Oh, I'm not going to keep going, no. I wish we would have... So people were saying, oh, these alerts and all this stuff, and you could use the darkness arrow, and you could go to unlock the room, but no one was like, oh, you could just sneak up on the hag and kill her. <laughs> That's learning for you. Can't blame it on you guys. I didn't know. I didn't know... Yeah, it's huge PB though. That's huge. Now we know. Now we know the appropriate way to start the fight. You know? That's huge. I didn't know I could just reveal her with my eye like that. Well, shit. We're gonna try a different class. Okay? On, on Tuesday. Because tomorrow I will not be streaming. On Tuesday, we're going to try a whole different build, different class, all like that, okay? So, you know, something to look forward to. We haven't done any wizardry yet, so maybe Tuesday is a day for wizard to try shit out, you know? Or like sorcerer. I've never, I, I've only beat the game once, and that was as wizard, so maybe I'll try some sorcerer or some warlock stuff. Druid is stinky. I don't want to be stinky druid. Yuck. Gross. Stinky druid? Maybe. Who knows? Eventually we'll do a druid at some point. Um, who is streaming today doing what? Um... You know, it's this guy's birthday. Let's go rate him for the birthday. Spore Druid. 
I mean, druids are stinky though, man. They got hair all in there. They got like nasty bear hairs and stuff. You know, like stinky druids. All right, we're going to go raid someone in MUE because it's their fucking birthday. So say happy birthday for me, guys. And I will be back on Tuesday to continue our deathless shenanigan attempts here. And it's been a lot of fun. Just wish I would have known how to start the hag a little bit better. Whoops. We know for next time. No. Peace, guys.